sorry for that little bit of a little bit of banner. Hello, everybody. Welcome to uh, this episode of um, uh, Mega Dawn, our Star Frontiers Alpha Hawks game. Um, it's been about a month since we last gamed because of various circumstances, but we've got everybody here today, which is great. Say hello, everybody. Hello, hello. everybody. Everybody. And uh, just to remind people where we are, uh, the uh, budget crew are currently on the planet Alcazar. Um, they have been uh, contracted to find out what happened to the CDC Corporation's mining operations uh, and to uh, investigate a new mining operation that has appeared on the planet. Uh, it turns out that the Streel Corporation um, uh, sabotaged the original mining operation and set up their own and are trying to steal the planet out from underneath um, the CDC. Uh, so far, the group have attacked the, comp the uh, Streel compound twice um, have made some headway each way, but have been repulsed b uh, both times. Um, at the moment, uh, everyone's pretty much A-OK -okay back at the uh, little village of n local primates called Lacure, Um except uh, Cerise is in a very, very bad way. Uh, Cerise is currently in a status field, um, uh, s slowly dying. Uh, they'll need to get her to a um, med bay at least, preferably a hospital, but a med day sometime in the next 200 hours, otherwise uh, she'll be dead. Um, so that's that's a little bit of pressure on the group now. Um, so uh, we re-enter the fray, shall we say, uh, on the morning after the last attack. What do you guys want to do? Uh, I took all the grenades from Cerise's bag, I just I just take the whole bag. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Um Where's the nearest med bay? Uh in the Streel Corpor in the Streel Corporation. Yep. So time oh, yeah. to <laughs> throw I don't Cerise, you wanna dish out grenades? You wanna give your inventory of grenades? Sure, I'll, I'll put it in, in chat. chat. Yeah. Uh, Maybe. Basically, I. This is what I think we should do. We should just storm the compound with a lot of grenades. We still have some RPG shots, I believe. Uh, so when they go to man the the, uh, the machine guns, we can blow them up. Yeah, we have seven sure. rockets. Did we repair the ground car? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that would be that was And we did that. some scouting as well. I forgot what it brought back. Oh, oh yeah, it uh that they have one guard in the northwest tower, one guard in the southeast tower. Uh and I believe they didn't have anybody on the roof. Uh and I that know, was pretty much it for their guard. Uh-huh. So we just have to take out one guard tower, and then we can storm the compound. Uh, I'm pretty sure they fit the hole in the fence, so we might have to, you know, make another hole. Uh... Silly question, but is there a sniper? No, they don't Amongst them or amongst us? Us. Oh. Uh... I don't know, is anyone yeah, particularly right. good with a rifle of some sort? The closest would be the heavy laser and jazz, I think. Well, I don't know if that's a sniper. It's a goddamn... Sure, we... <laughs> but it's shooting from far away. And... Yeah, it's like... There's a big range on that. A handheld I mean, laser cannon is a sniper. Uh-huh. Sorry, I, I missed that. I missed that. Uh, uh, cat, what was that? Does the heavy laser outrange the machine gun, or are we pretty at uh, risk? I can't uh, recall. I think it does, yeah. Yes, I think it does. I think that, no, I think the recoil rifle is better range. Yeah, but we got <coughs> none of those left, so. It would are be great if that, in? it would be great if they didn't blow them up in that car that was full of them but oh well 
Are we all going in together, or is someone going to stand off and take pot shots? I don't know. It's up I to think, you guys, isn't uh, it? If you want uh, someone to stand off and take pot shots, I think Jazz would have the best chance of actually hitting you from afar. But, yeah. but I mean, you might also want to have Jazz um, storming the castle. Uh, what we? castle? <laughs> Storm of the outpost. Did we get an appreciation for whether they had any uh, sort of uh, ground cars or hover vehicles that they would come and rain fire down on us from? Uh, um, not anymore. The, the, the impression you got is you destroyed those when you were crossing that river. Uh, remember? Yeah, yeah. I, I just, I just didn't know whether we saw it, there were there any extras around. No, there's uh, no none that you can see. The only, the only vehicles are more, uh, are more machine, uh, mining, strip mining machinery vehicles. Yeah. Um. So yeah, not, not cars and things like that. Although I suppose you could load a lot, of, a lot of people into the big dump trucks and, you know, with rifles and things like that. But yeah. Is I mean. Driving through the fence and making a hole wasn't a great idea. Uh, that kind of wrecked our car, and we kind of need the car to get away. So that th doing that again does not sound like a great plan. Uh, the but gate we can't is really locked. afford to get away, otherwise Reese might die. Yeah. Well, I mean, how else are you gonna make a hole in the fence? Quickly. Uh, we need to bring Cerise in, right? She's right. We got to bring her in. We got to get in. We we can't. <laughs> We can't fail this time. We, we we can't stop without getting to the med bay. Well, we don't need to bring her in on our assault. I mean, we just leave her with the little cuckoo. We go and salt, clear the place, and then we bring Ceres in afterwards. I mean, that's probably ideal. Well, uh, I I I because I don't, we're not going to be able to use the med bay if we haven't cleared them all out. I think. Clearing them all out is our only option at this point. Yeah, there's uh, like eight of them left with their cap. Yeah, don't forget the people who are manning the mine. Uh, there's, there are extras. They might not be particularly military, but there are. They there have are civilians. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're probably not going to be particularly happy if we uh, take control over the outpost. Yeah, well, um, we're the ones with the guns. Yeah. And grenade. Yeah. We could put them all to sleep if we wanted to. So I, 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 in my head, it feels like the best thing to do would be to engage them from afar and draw them out into a place where we're not in an open plane getting mowed down by machine guns. Because uh, that, that seems to be where it's all fallen apart. Uh, we're either in a choke point where we can't really out and we get destroyed uh, we need to kind of meet them in on our own terms um, well that's what we did with our ambush with the river we fought them on our own terms but we still got shredded yeah. you didn't get shredded you didn't you didn't really get shredded not really one of you got caught caught with in a in a heavy in a heavy fire to race mostly well they did bring right. the machine guns to us they did. So they did. We're gonna if we kill the if we storm the compound, they're not gonna be able to get to their machine guns because their machine guns are on the tower. How but if we wait outside the compound them? and engage them from the tree line, they're gonna shoot at us with machine. Guns. The heavy laser outranges the machine guns. Yeah, but with all the trees. Yeah. I mean, with if you want it, we can try it. Get within. With all the trees around the compound, you know, you, you, you've got to get within a kilometre, which is the machine gun range. Long machine gun range, admittedly, but still within range. Is there is there a sort of uh, elevated vantage point that we could do this from? Only, like the, only the, the scree mount on the west. Okay, yeah. If it's long machine gun range, that still put us at a pretty significant advantage. I think that's still medium uh, heavy laser range. Because the thing that really owned us last time was that we were 
we were in a bad range for our sh small arms. Yeah. And and that's really all we had other than because we were we were we were pretty poor piss poor with the uh, rocket launchers. So they were almost. Yeah, you were very piss. You were very uh, piss poor with the rocket launchers, to be honest. Um, they're almost. They were almost not worth firing, and the small arms like the assault rifles just it wasn't close enough to be able to do a lot of damage yeah uh, you're you 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 are you're in, you're in that anti sweet spot you're in that real sour spot in terms of you know in terms of where you were range wise uh so if we if we could if we could get them to a point where and we couldn't get any closer because there was a friggin river in the road um yeah, so, I mean, do we want to do the ambush style? Do we want to wait at the tree line? I don't think we should wait at the tree line, because if we wait at the tree line, they're going to shoot at us with, what, four machine guns, and we're going to shoot at them with one heavy laser. No matter how good we are with the heavy laser, they have, like, eight people left, so they can man the machine gun. Um, Actually, they've, the got, machine they've, guns? Got eight, they've got eight people, plus the miners. Plus the miners, if they want to put up a fight. Uh, where's the where are the machine guns mounted currently, based upon our last scouting? Uh, they're back in the towers, is where you would suspect them to be. And all four of them are there. Oh well, we don't know yet. We wouldn't know yet. I recall hearing there were two, but. Well, so there were two guards in the towers. One in the northwest, one in the southeast. I don't recall if our scouting came up with how many machine guns were were in each tower. Only one. Only one, so they didn't have another one tower. mounted. So no, if one we in each were, tower. so depending on which direction we come from, there'd only be one, maybe two machine guns that they can bring to bear on us. Yeah, you've already had that discussion weeks ago. Week, weeks ago in real time, days ago mm -hmm. in game time. Um, depending yeah. on your, depending on how you approach, you'll be, you'll have two, two or three, depending on what your exact angle of approach is. Unless you're coming yeah. from the west, like you did, you, you did last time. In which case, they'll have to dismount machine guns and you know do that. Unless you want to take the actual scree mound and fire and have an, uh, have the height advantage. But you are definitely in, you are definitely, that's only a few metres off the fence lines, remember? That's three mount. So, yeah. yeah um, but that's, that's your choice. That's, they are your tactical choices at the moment. So the range from the scree mount is just metres? Oh, well, depending on where you're talking about, but yeah, it's not very far at all. Okay, so then I'd say we approach from the east. Yeah, that being the the cl the closest that we can pop up and kind of not be seen from the east, the scree mount to the west. Just reminding you. Well, the well the scree mount is so close to the out because if we're gonna, so are we storming the compound or are we gonna bait them out at the tree line? I I don't understand how we're gonna storm the compound and not just get murdered at a fence. Uh, uh, we well, spam the, grenades. The, the, other, the other, the other, the other thing you got to think about is how you gotta, is what are your chances of drawing them out? Not likely I mean, because they they're they have eight people. They're in a fortified they, position. So, so yeah. what what'll happen is we kill one or two guys. They're likely to then retreat inside the compound, and then we have to storm the compound. And they're going to be fortified, and they're going to be ready inside the compound. Are they going to be? Or uh, we storm it again, gonna... and give them less time to prepare. Okay, let's just go for it. I, we're going to get killed anyway, so let's let's just do it. <laughs> so my only other question is, how are you going to get through the fence? Can I put a battering ram on the front of the explorer? With Why what? don't we just use uh, wire cutters? I got no gloves? idea. Surely you must have it... rubber gloves. No. And uh, I assume electrified <laughs> means means alarmed. Yeah. 
Therese, you're unconscious. Shut up. <laughs> well, I mean, I was thinking that wood because that's like the only natural resource around here. Yeah, the trees are pretty big though, and there's no, and yeah. Yeah. All right, don't forget, yeah, you, know, you guys are actually using a hollowed out tree for a, for a, a hut at the moment. Yeah, I wouldn't take, I probably wouldn't take that and put that at the front of the Explorer, because that's just like, hey, we're going to take this great big tree that you worked on so hard, and, and we're going to strap it to the front of our vehicle and then go ram the outpost that just murdered no, all I your was, friends. Yeah, yeah, I was giving you an example of the size of the trees. Okay. I have rope. That's about it. Tree of making, yeah. Uh, so, are we? So, I take it we're storming the compound then? Because Cat's the only one to speak up. That boot. Dot. I don't have Jet. much way of range weaponry that I'm good with get me inside the walls and I can close with and I'm a factor. Well, Alright, Jazz, why what do you... We have, why wouldn't we have Jazz shoot from afar for a while um, at any of the people that present themselves as targets and then if they tend to retreat away from their position on the towers, you know, then we, then we storm. So or, we, fire. or we or we head into um, the uh, hidden hidden tunnel again. I like the suppressing well. fire idea. Okay, I've got a new plan. How much... Maybe get. Uh, Jazz, how much uh, explosive charges do you have? Zero. Uh, we we used little. it all on the last one. You used it all? We used yep. it all to yeah, go have... through that wall. Yeah. You have no explosive charge left. No, no Tordium D19 Even that bit we stole from the bomb they tried to blow us up yeah, with earlier? You, yeah, you, it's, I, it's, I have, you've used it all. I have one charge. Just one charge. You have a 50 green charm, charge left, do you? How much yeah. damage does that, does that one do? It might blow the uh, lock off a gate. I, I have to look <laughs> it up. Okay. Huh. All right, so never mind that plan. I was gonna say I mean, it, might be, it might be enough for the fence. I mean, it's a. Fence. I doubt it. The f I doubt it. The fence is. It's a the thick fence. fence. Is, um, it, it's it. No, it's a it's a it's a a wire fence, and most of the blast is gonna go nowhere. Oh, it'll just blow through it. Oh. You think? Yeah, that's what happens with wire fences. What about like a a, a fence post? It must be yeah, it might it might take the fence post out, but whether it'll take the fence down from the fence post is might is another issue. And then that's a pain in the butt to walk across and get across. Okay, I mean, so never okay. mind my if new plan. I was going to suggest we just blow a hole in the wall while they fortify, so that way we make a new entrance and they don't fortify that entrance because it's a brand new entrance. But um. I mean, it's, um, I don't know if we ever got a look at it, but like the front gate, does it look like that it can be like hacked from the outside and then jury rig to, to open? Yeah, but you'll be under fire by at least two machine guns at the time. Right, so if we manage to, to scare them off from our range, you know, such that once they try to man the tower, we'll go pick them off and they get off the tower, we could potentially if everything goes well, try to get through the front gate with uh, some of um, folks' uh, mechanical skills. Maybe yeah. So what I can see as our two plans is one, we just take the explorer, we ramp through one of the gates, uh, through the fence, and then we kill a guy in a tower, probably that guy in that tower, and then we storm the inside of the compound and we use a lot of grenades to kill people. Or we sit back at the tree line, approach from the east as well, and um, shoot who we can. And then once they all retreat back inside, then we approach slowly. And um, 
then we assault them when they're ready. After we get... Ramming, ramming our, our vehicle, our last, this is our only vehicle left, right? Well, we've done it before and I fits. <laughs> Is that is true? No, I'm inclined to try and um, shoot them from afar until they, they retreat into their outpost. But then we go and fight them more on their terms, probably. Um, if we ran them with a car, we're driving through machine gun fire, um, which is pretty much on their terms as it is. And then we're inside and it's still on their terms inside. And may not have a retreat option. Yeah, but. I don't think you've got a retreat option no matter what happens to tell you the truth. Yeah, yeah that's true. We, we... If we're to save Ceres, we don't have a retreat option. Anyway, the doc's not planning on retreating. And if the doc goes down, you guys are really screwed. Nah, you guys are fine. Alright, we can we can <laughs> take it cautiously and take time. It'll hurt Ceres, but we can take time. Yeah, that's the other thing to remember, guys, is that, is that every hour that Ceres is in a... Every in 10 a hours. Point, every 10 hours, sorry, he, um, he loses a point. Of his um, highest stat, half his highest high stat, of her highest stat. I don't think the stat is so much the issue. It's just do we have enough power to keep this cryo thing running for days and days? Well, it'll run by its, it'll run on its current power on its current power pack for two hundred hours. Yeah, so so we got right. ten days. If you if if you hook up another pa if you hook up another power pack another power pack to it, power backpack to it, it'll run for another two hundred hours. It uses one ECU every twenty hours from memory. Oh, was that right? That sound right? Uh, or anyway, something on, something on this. Uh, yeah, yeah, something like that. Anyway, bottom line is, um, as long as you've got power and sh and and Cerise has got stat points, she'll stay alive. All right, but. You've got no way of recharging your power packs at the moment, remember? Alright, so let's try the... If we're all in agreement, we can try the... Take them out as they come out. And then when they retreat inside, if we're still in good condition to do that, we'll attack. Um, for the... Trying to take them from out from afar, um, we probably only need... Uh, the driver of the vehicle, Jazz, to fire, and maybe the dock um, to do a bit of first aid if we actually get hit while we're inside the car. So we right, only that's... need myself, you, and the dock? That's kind of what I'm thinking, and then Babu and Kat can hang back a bit, and then if, uh, if uh, they retreat from the outpost, like from the, the guard towers, then they can emerge and you... then we all... Why yeah, so the three. Variation? Why don't you try a variation of your first plan? A variation of crashing into the wall. No. If you only need three of you in the in the explorer with the with the heavy laser, Babu and Cat, if they're the two that are that are free, they could always try. They could always try and uh, go through the tunnel again. They could. But the problem is they would have no doctor. On that's them. that's then a uh, two v sit, most likely sit. Sorry, say again. That's probably a two v sits for. Th which they're not likely to win. Or two v four, two v five, actually. If, well, if you guys are, if you guys are making enough, ra if, are you guys enough making enough racket to the east? But, you know. And Babu and Cat could sneak inside and disable things if they wanted to do it that way. Anyway, it's up to you guys. I'm just, uh, this, this, that's just another option that's come across, that's 
chemical yeah, somebody's mind. I don't think we need to risk more lives at the moment. Because with just two of them, that's very risky. Yeah, if the two of them were to go in, I... Not that I don't have confidence in you, Babu and Cat, but I, I think you're going to die. Because you also, they also have Rob. Oh, is Robbie still functional? I'm pretty sure Robbie's still fun. Yeah, they have eight guys in Rob. Oh, right. They they took over. I, yeah, that's right. They have our robot. That's even worse. Well, it's their robot. Actually, not yours. Now. It should be ours. Robbie had a better time with us. Yeah, you uh, did. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, how far is the fence line to the tree line on the east side? About a kilometer. Okay, that'll work. Does that work for you, Jazz? Can you snipe them at a, kilo at a kilometer? Yeah, sure. What's the range increments on the heavy lift? I'm looking at a pound. Uh, at a kilometer, you'll be at long range. No. What's medium? 500 meters. Okay, we'll stay at a kilometer. I thought you might. Uh, let's see, machine gun. Machine is it extreme? Is 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 extreme at that range? In fact, that's just about as extreme as you can get. It's well, uh, yeah. Long range oh. is yeah, it's 40. Uh, All right. The recoilless rifles at medium, or short even. And what about the heavy uh, machine medium. gun at 500 meters? That's machine guns at 500 meters is it long. And that's medium range for us. Do we want to do that? Um, we could. Um, but just thinking just now with the recoilless rifle, I mean, we only have like what three, four shells left. Uh, the recoilless rifle. I, uh, know, I think we're out. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah we're out of recoilless yeah. rifle shells. We have seven rockets. That's it. Just seven rockets and the heavy laser. Uh, you're at okay. uh, extreme range with the rockets, too. Yeah. Yeah, so... Do you well, want to engage them? Because I don't think you're likely to hit them at long range with the heavy laser, right, Jazz? Uh, let's see. Long is uh, minus is 40 penalty with careful aim. So that's a negative 25 off of. Negative 25. So I'd have a 50 50 chance at long range. Do you have a 50 50 chance? 50 don't 50. forget the minus don't forget the minus 10 for being heavy heavy weapon. Ah, 40% chance. Hmm. So at medium it would be a 60% chance. Medium on the heavy laser, long for their machine guns. And what's the uh what's at what range? What's the range increments for the machine gun? Like between five hundred and one thousand, where does it drop off from its stream? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It's just five hundred. Oh, five hundred is its stream. Yeah. Five hundred one extreme. Five hundred one's extreme for a machine gun. Five hundred's uh, long. Oh, okay, so yeah, then we can just advance. All right, so, well, I think we can just start firing at one kilometer and then start trading shots. If you don't kill him yet, then we, because we don't have that much power.
Yeah, we don't have all that much power. Put in the backpack. Well, if you don't have that, that much power, if you don't have that much power, then from a military point of view, um, your best your best bet's to storm them. I hate to say it. Get in close, make sure your shots count, and uh, get, in, get inside the compound as quick as you could, which would mean driving over the, ramming over the, the, the fence again. Or sneaking through the tunnel, or whatever. But if you're running out of ammo, then you've got to make every shot count. Um, so yeah, then do we want to start works. firing when we get to 500? We could. That's fine as well. Um, well, if you're on the, if you're firing, hang on, hang on, hang on. If you're firing on the move, don't forget you've got the movement rate, the movement penalty for true. firing on the move. Yeah. Yeah, you'd All have right, to so, stop. So, you know, you have to stop uh, wherever you go, you, you go to. And, of course, you know, which is why I said if, you, if, you, if you're running out of ammo, you're going to have to make every shot count. And if you're going to make every shot count, you've got to get as close as you possibly can as quickly. Yeah, and it's a heavy laser, so they yeah. probably have mm -hmm. albedo screens on. Hey, um, I, I actually need to step away for a bit. Uh, I have a friend who's locked out of uh, her apartment, and I've got a spare key. So I need to step away for about 10 minutes or so. But um, right. feel free to go ahead and start shooting with Jazz or Apologies. Yeah, so... That's uh, right. So what do other people think? Babu? Cat? Babu's better situated for the rush, but again, like I said, I'm more up close and personal, so anything that's at range is going to be... You know, I can try to snipe, but it ain't going to be very good. I think they learned of our fondness for laser weapons, so I think they're going to have albedo screens on. Which means the heavy laser is going to be used. Well, useless until it uh, until they get chew through their power. But, but we don't have the power to spare. No, you don't have the power to spare, and with their reactor, they're probably fully charged again by now. Yeah. So. What do you think? What do you think, Cat? I think we're hosed either way, so. I probably don't really have an opinion anymore. Okay, can we <laughs> mount the heavy laser on the vehicle and use the vehicle's battery as a battery pack for it? Uh, you, you, it's not really. It's not, it's not designed that way. Okay. What about you, Doc? What's your, what are your, what's your opinion? Well, I like the idea of standing off with suppressing fire and then rushing in once the coast is clear, because that's the priority is... Yeah, but if they have albedo the screens on, the coast isn't going to be clear. Uh, that's not the doc's problem, is it? <laughs> it's a nice way of dodging it. So, where does the tunnel come out? Where in the compound uh, does the tunnel lead? Basically, in the middle of where they, where, where your tokens are standing on the map at the moment. Okay, and yeah, that's that like scribbles where we blew up the hole. That's where that's where it was blown in the wall. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm thinking we just gotta storm the compound. Because if they have albedo screens, then we're gonna get chewed to pieces by the heavy machine gun if we step out. Yeah, well, since I seem to be the only one. We're going to go with storming the compound. Uh, if there's anything I can do to brace the front of the explorer to ram through the fence, I will. 
Yeah, okay, that's all right. So everyone's going to be in the Explorer. Yep. Is, you, is Jazz going to be on top with the, well, Pucky set out the top with the, um, with the machine gun, with the um, heavy laser? Yep. Okay. Uh, and where are you planning on hitting the fence? Well... We made a hole in the fence before. Does it look like they completely replaced the fence? It looks like it's been at least somewhat repaired from your scoutings. Okay. Um. And what do you plan to do? And what do you plan to do once you get inside the fence line? Well, I think we'll just uh, make a break in the fence line. Go straight there. So drive through the fence at one end of the line, and we're going to drive towards uh, the door. And that's where we're going to breathe. Okay. And you're driving, yeah. obviously, because... Want to try to drive through the door to breach the door that way? Uh, no, I I don't think the explorer can take down a freaking wall. Not wall door no. there. Yeah, well, it's the, it's a small door. The, the explorer is bigger than the door. Don't forget. Are you going to do a skew turn to try and put the back of the explorer near the door or not? Yeah, I will. Okay. I suppose. <laughs> Everybody happy with this plan? Well, happy is probably not the right word. Okay. Sounds fine. Because we're screwed if they have albedo screens at long range. And I think they will know of our fondness for the heavy laser, considering how many people we've killed with it. All right. So yeah, let's go with so that. When, when, when are you going to put this plan into, in, into action? Uh, we're going to do it at 2 a.m. Sorry, I missed that. What was that? I vote for 2 a.m. 2 a.m. 2, 2 a.m. in the morning. Well, the equivalent of 2 a.m. in the morning. It's the equivalent, yeah. When oh, they're the most that. high. Don't forget, the planet is um, uh, locked almost locked in and the days are something like 4,000 hours long oh yeah that's so right there is, no, there is no there is no nightfall yeah so the, then we're just gonna go as soon as we're ready okay because if it's, it's oh. since it's always day there's no point in waiting around yeah well not always day but it's it's for all practical purposes it's always yeah the sun, There's the not going to be night for there. a few thousand hours. Well, for yeah, a couple hundred at least, but yeah, something like that. Yeah, so we'll just go as soon as we're all ready. Alright. So, I'm assuming that the minute you break the tree line, you are going to ex accelerate to maximum um, and uh, and cross the, you know. Yes, but before I, br I hit the fence, I'm not well, I've driven through the f before. How did I feel when I drove through the fence? Was I was Matt speed just enough to break through it, or was that more than enough? Uh, you couldn't tell. Couldn't tell. Okay. All right, Jazz is back. All right, Jazz. The plan is we're storming the comp. Through the line. Alright. Through All the right. red line. More like. Yeah, more like that. Uh. Oh, sorry, what's the name of the map? Uh, it's the outpost map. That's it. Alright. Okay. 
So, everyone ready? Yep. Uh, should I be firing as we move, or, sh or just holding fire till we after we crash? Uh. Well, it, it's up to you. You make the decision when you when you feel like it. It would, would, would be my. Would we be can my use advice. you can use like the the backpack that has thirty power left. You can use that one while we're on the move. I suppose. And then. Oh swap to a different one once we get inside i suppose is anyone going to poke their head out of the top of the explorer with the rocket launchers uh we'll have that prepared uh if they have albedo screens jazz will take out the rocket launcher or at least that's what i suggest yeah that's fair i think that makes sense because if they have albedo screens, the rocket launchers, then that's the thing to use. All right. right. But so. looking through looking through our, um, whatever it's called, the binocular type thing, will we be able to see any of the shimmering albedo screen on the individuals? Or is it just... Not, on the, not, on, the, not on the move, you won't. Right, but then before, like, from a, from a kilometer away. Oh, before we start... Mm. Here. Possibly. Possibly not. Okay. Okay. Let's go for it. Now everybody strap in if you're gonna strap in. Yep, I Ghost suggest Ghost that. Seatbelts on. What was that Ghostbuster scene? It's like uh Bill Murray's like I love this plan, let's do it. Yeah, that's Anyone right. Remembers. The uh, right at the end when they're fighting the, fighting the um. Oh, cross the streams. Cross the plan. streams. Yeah, I love this thing. Let's do it. Um. All right. So, uh, you come flying out of the uh, out of the tree line, gunning the engine. Can I? You give me a a a, a drive roll, please. Vook. Damn right you can. <laughs> Damn right I can. Okay, so you uh, you pound across the um, uh, you pound across the uh, the the open plain towards the compound. Um, you get about halfway halfway there, and the two machine guns on the east side open up t on you. And uh, this is when Jazz returns fire on one of the towers. From long, long. from medium range. Be medium. Medium range, right, at this stage? Oh, we're medium already. Oh, okay. Yeah, but was he able to tell on our drive, on the short distance between 500 and 1 kilometer, if they had the shimmer? No, not when, not when you're driving in. No, you couldn't tell from the tree line either. Okay. Okay. So... Then shoot the guy in the south tower. In the southern tower. South tower, okay. Uh, what do you get? Penalties? Well, uh, medium range, heavy weapon, no careful aim, you're bouncing around too much. And, and fast uh, vehicle. And fa no, that's when you're trying to, sh that's when you're att trying to shoot a fast vehicle. Oh. Um, you want to, uh, you want, um, uh, the mo when you're moving. Alright, attacker. Running, moving, whatever. Babu is, uh, ready some frag grenades so. and his four sack at the moment. So that's I think medium. Much. That's medium and the ten for heavy. Mm-hmm. And he will be using albedo screen. Okay. So that's a forty-one. Oh, sorry, I, I didn't see your roll. Well, yeah, okay. Um, so uh, what was the what we did? What did you have the medium laser set to? Sorry, the uh, heavy laser set to. What I always <laughs> tend to leave a set at. Uh, Which is ten. what? Ten. Okay. Well, roll me ten dice then, please. All right. Roll me the because you hit, obviously. Okay. Uh, that was the southeast tower, wasn't it? That's him. Um, where were we? Oh, did, did they open fire on us yet? Yep. And miss. At that range, they would. 
especially when the fire yeah. turns on. I take it you're finding out his defense. No, I'm taking actually finding out his. Um, where the hell? Oh, that's where it is. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Okay, uh, the the south tower goes quiet in terms of firing at you. Okay? Uh, can you give me another another drive roll, please, mate? Oh, whew. I rolled a... F I got a critical success, and now, ooh, not so... Critical foul. Yeah, okay. Well, that On near critical foul. Okay. What is that for dodge? Uh, just general, general driving at the moment, mate. Give me a second. Yeah, I'm not the greatest driver. No, you're not. Our good driver is currently uh. What? Our good driver is currently not very good at driving. Mm-hmm. Are I'm you wearing a straight? Are you wearing a screen at all, Jazz, or anything like that? Uh, just a video screen and the, uh, yeah, okay. the regular suit. All right. Well, you take thirty points of damage from a burst that um, Vogue unfortunately drove into. <laughs> so Machine gun fire! Drive right at it. Yeah, oh, 15, wow. 15, 15 for your suit and fifteen for you if it's a skin suit. Um, and uh, you may take another shot uh, if you want to shoot at the north tower, the one that just shot you. Uh, Is yep. the south uh, tower quiet now and you can't see the target? The south tower is quiet. Uh, what's the range now? Is it still medium? Uh, no, you're down to short. Okay, that helps. Uh, short range. Uh, 10 penalty for heavy. That should be 55 to hit. Should be 55. Ah, you're good. And guy, uh, thank you. Okay, you physically see the guy in the North Tower um, uh, uh, fall at this range. Huh, they're not wearing suits. They're not using Alpedo screens. Um, and, Huzzah! Uh, uh, huzzah. Uh, you want to you give me one more driving roll as you hit the fence, please? Um, so, if there's no more yes, then before <laughs> he actually hits the fence, um, Jazz is going to duck back down into the car. Uh, you need to give me a reaction speed check for that, please, mate. Yeah, sure. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, you could fall out of the you could fall out of the thing onto the fence. <laughs> uh, I, I, okay, I should not have asked him. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, yes, you mentioned duck duck, duck back down uh, and brace yourself. Um, you hit the fence at full speed. Um, uh, the fence sparks. Uh, you managed to pick the spot where the fence was weakest because that's where you hit the last time, obviously. Um, and I need another uh, uh, one more driving test to do the skew turn and brake. Otherwise, you're going to plow into the. Oh my god. No, you're going to plow into the, into the building. Uh, well, you know, two critical successes and then a critical. F well. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Um, so uh, We're here. The, you. You're out of control when you hit the when you hit the hit the thing. Um, everybody who's belted in, which does not include Jazz, yet, um, is going to take half damage from the from the resulting crash. Um, now crashes, crashes, crashes. Can Boo Boo Babu attempt to grab Jazz and hold him? You can attempt to grab him, but I mean I don't I don't think you're going to hold on to him. You ever try to hold on to somebody when you're in a crash? <laughs> was there any uh, uh, any attempt to try and buckle in before hitting the wall, or just not? You didn't have enough. You, you, you haven't got. You, haven't, you, haven't, you simply haven't got the time, mate. Okay. Uh, um, no matter how good of a driver I was, critical fail still is a critical fail. Unfortunate. I didn't expect this to happen.
crashes. Okay. I drove really well, then really poorly, then really well again, then really, really bad. Mm -hmm. Hey, you hit that fence just right. I hit the fence just right. We got through the fence, but then uh, after that, not so Maybe good. Maybe we'll get through this wall, too. If we Did do, that'd be great. That door <laughs> instead of the wall. <laughs> if we actually do, that'd be great. Though we might not be able to drive. I need each of you to roll... Uh, 7d10. Uh, you can sort, you can, uh, yeah, everyone roll 7d10. You can subtract two from each dice roll uh, to a minimum of one. So don't take 14 off the total, subtract two from each dice roll. Okay? Um, for being an explorer. Alright? And if you're belted in, you can then halve that final result. Yeah, ooh, math. Do the skin suits absorb any or no? Uh, and yes, skin suits will absorb uh, uh, half that again. Joy, my skin suit's completely gone. Nice. Just an... Oh, well, I'm just... Oh, well, you, you're the one who crashed into the wall, crashed into the, through the wall. Yeah, well... Into the wall. Built it in, you take half damage. Yeah. You Built in, you take half damage. Minus yeah. two per die. And uh, yeah, to a minimum of one per dice. So for those who those who've been rolling one on their dice, sorry, you don't get to re re reduce them. Yeah, anymore. so Babu, you got a uh, you got seventeen, and you have that. Right. So is that eight or nine? Uh, uh, eight to the skin suit, nine to you. Uh, other way around, nine to the skin yeah. suit, eight to you. Okay. You you ran out. Yeah. Uh, if that makes sense, the skin suit always takes the odd point if there's an odd point. All right, and I also um, now stunned. Is anyone stunned? Jazz is wounded. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I was not expecting them to not be prepared. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, uh, so and and you come to a dead a dead halt. The wall is damaged but not breached, um, and so I need everybody at the moment to give me an initiative roll, please. Where's the combat tracker? Just combat tracker. And Babu starts out through the form. Oh wait, wait. Well, yes, yeah, Therese is uh, unconscious. Much unconscious. So <laughs> even she beats Therese. Me. Pizza is. Okay, so. That pizza is. Uh, yep, yep. Six for Mr. Babu. Should I put a minus one or two on that to represent no. being unconscious? Oh, I can if you want, but it's up to you. I don't know. I think you can't benefit from your debts. Well, you've been benefiting from uh, I think that's a solid <laughs> one, debt. Oh, you don't. You, you, what are you rolling for initially for, um, Cerise? You can't. You know, you're unconscious. You're not even. I'm there. just trying to see if you village. notice. You're back at the village. Nice one. I think we mm. took Cerise with us because we have to operate. No. I thought you were living at the village. We don't well, have to immediately. Okay. We're at the tree line. Yeah, you can be at the train line if you want. Doesn't bother me. Yeah, and all this crashing around probably would have just killed them. In the yeah. Probably okay. Okay. Uh, I've just been informed my toilet is overflowing, so I'm now handyman, handyman <laughs> doc. Go, doc. Go, yes, go, <laughs> nice. go, go. Hey, what was that? It's a doctor of plumbing. Doctor of toilets. Doctor of plumbing. Yeah, something like that. Well, I mean, Ted, if you have a doctorate in, like, hydraulics, aren't you a doctor of plumbing? 
Um, technically, I suppose, yes. But plumbing, plumbing hydraulics? Wait, no, not hydraulics. Uh, hi, it's like water, water pressure. Hydroponics. That's hydraulics. Hydroponics, that's, that's it. No, hydroponics is growing. Wait, no, yeah, that's... <laughs> hydraulics. I think we've become delirious with the bashing we got in this vehicle. Jazz, what do you want to do? Um, Jazz will poke his head up um, and uh, take the controls of the, the laser. Um, yep. And it will also, it will also yell out, Get ready to reload. Someone. Yeah, what is it? All right. That's, well, if that's, your, I, I assume, if that's what you're doing, I assume that's it. I assume that's all he has time to do. Yeah, if that's what if that's what you're doing, then by all means, um, hit the hit the next next actor button on the combat tracker. In, in, in poking his head out, did he see anyone around? Not yet. Okay. Cat. Uh, Cat would be buckled in, so I guess her action is unbuckling herself. And then, what would you plan to do? Uh, would I have enough action to respond to Jazz's call and do the reloading? Oh, I don't know. You can get there. I don't know if you. I don't know if you can actually do it. You have to certainly scramble across to the to where he is. He'll do J that. Jazz, Jazz yells, "Get ready to reload!" Not. Nah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. End your turn when you're ready. Okay. Thank you. Vogue. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna unbuckle and. Uh... Get ready to hop. You could actually hop out if you wanted to. Uh... I, I hear some reluctance in your voice. <laughs> I'll, I'll wait and double <laughs> and make sure I'm not going to get shot in the back by a machine. Okay. End your turn, please. Alright. Um, he's in there. And so, um, right, okay, yep, I know what's happening. Doc, oh, Doc's not there. What's, what would Doc do, most likely, do you think? Probably unbuckle and uh, see a start. You could do aid first people. aid, right? What, well, probably just. No, not, we've, not, if he's got to not if he's got to unbuckle at the same time. No, like unbuckle he... and then move into position. Okay. I guess he uh, could prepare to do first aid too, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, get into position uh, to do first aid. Hang on a sec. What have I got? Here we go. Do have. Yeah, okay. I just got there. Uh -huh. And and turn step back, turn step back, turn get this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Babu! Alright, I'm assuming we're supposed to be trying to get in here as fast as we can, so I'll unbuckle and drop the ramp. The ramp, which is facing towards the east. That's because facing the wrong way, but that was the plan, wasn't it? It was, yes. We're not, so we're 90 there. degrees off. Well, <laughs> something like that. So you dropped the ramp. Okay, no problem at all. Um, Cerise was dead. Um, and so, any shifts, please, people. No, Cerise is indeed Cerise is in stasis. Do you want to roll for Doc, Cerise? If you can, oh, you can't. I'll have to do it. Babu got a nine. And Jazz got a 14. And Cat got a nine. Where's Cat? Cat, 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 cat. And Vote got a six. Three. Stop rolling. You told me to roll for Doc. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. And then, I, then, I, then I said, oh, don't worry, I'll do it. It was too quick for you. And Doc got a 15. That's what she said. <laughs> she said Doc got a 15. Right, okay. That's a very unusual thing for a son to say. Um, and um, the others, the others... Oops, missed one. Um, 
the other's got um, and um, sorry. Um, 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 Can I ask a quick question on Dralocyte physiology? I certainly can. Is it possible to hold my foresack and actually set up a little pseudopod that just a short stubby enough to pull a ring from a grenade? Yeah, but it'll, take, it'll take five minutes. It'll count as a finger and it takes five minutes. I best start doing that. Five minutes each round is six seconds, three to six seconds, you know. All right. Didn't yeah, think a of little it. too late. Uh, sorry, it's taking me a little bit of time to do this. This is just, uh, I've got to set this up properly, so otherwise, we're, you know, it's, um, it's not good. Okay. Uh, that's everybody. Doc's going to, you're back, not back, Doc, so we'll, we'll pause, Doc. Jazz? Uh, Jazz will, no, no targets have yet made themselves apparent, so Jazz will... Yep roll ready to fire once there is a target. Which way Some... are you looking? Um, like, like south and to the east, just like you would be with your other rifle. Well, draw me, draw me an, draw me an arrow in the general in the direction that your the center line of your sight is looking at. You know how to do that, don't you? In the meantime, yeah, okay, that'll do. Like that. Um, yeah, okay. And then, you know, Jess would yell out, Medic! <laughs> All right. Uh, but a first aid would take him out of wood. Okay, uh, that's that one. Uh, okay. Uh, Okay, uh, that's that one, uh, that one is good. Okay, uh, that's that one, that's that one. Uh, Babu! Babu! Jumping out of the back of that. Uh, do I am I able to ascertain where I'm at and that I need to get around to the uh, left side of the vehicle there to get to the door? Uh, yeah, you, you you've got a pretty good idea. You should, you should go to the right. You knew the plan there. was to make a turn, not crash straight into the wall. Right. Well, the plan was to run out the back here and hit the door. Yeah, yeah the the I plan was to, to turn to the right, but I never turned to the. Okay, so you're running there, are you? Yep. I'll try to get okay. the door open. All right, I'll need a strength check on that one. The door is slightly buckled in its frame. You'll have to hit it hard. Just strength? Yeah, straight strength. Yeah, that's Boom. hard. Yeah, that's hard. Boom! The door bursts open. I need a quick spot check off you. Your spot search? Yeah, I guess it will do. Same thing. 
rolling nice today. You had to go and say that, didn't you? Well, the last one I'll get. Oh, no. worse. Uh, oh, hey, Robbie, how's it? <laughs> uh, Robbie's there. Uh, Robbie hasn't taken aim yet, so Robbie was not ready for you, but Robbie is just there. Okay. All right. Um, do you want to take cover behind the side of the door? Yeah, I'm going to take cover and prep my grenade. Right, no worries. That's okay. We can, you can do all that. Cat, um, are you... What are you doing, Cat? Well, Jazz wanted to reload, but I just saw Babu run out, uh, probably to get himself killed. Uh, she is conflicted. <laughs> Uh, on where she should stay right now. Uh... Well, there's been no f there's been no firing for two ra uh, for two rounds out of the out of um, Jazz hasn't fired for two rounds, so there's no obviously no no targets. Yeah. Yeah, and we're not getting mm -hmm. shot at, so not at the uh, moment. She, she will say sorry, Jazz. I gotta go save Babu, uh, and follows around Babu. Now when you get out Where there, you see bad here? right there. Uh, when you get around there, you see you you see Babu hunking around the side of the door. Um, obviously, he's keeps he's take in. He looks like he's preparing grenades. Uh, obviously, there's something or someone through the door that you can't see yet. What do you want to do? Do you want to hunker down beside him? Yeah. So obviously the explorer's in the road, and I can't stand on the other side, right? Oh, uh, yeah, no, there's, it's too much. Yeah, I mean, you can squeeze in, but it's, you know, yeah, no. Okay. No, she'll, she'll, she'll honker down behind him. Okay. Okay. Uh, Robbie, uh, um, um, yeah, Robbie, Robbie does what Robbie does. <laughs> Vogue. Yep, I'm gonna hop out and I'm going to uh uh yeah, prepare to breach and prep a grenade of my own. Or can I throw a grenade in? Well, you get out that side. <sighs> I thought the driver's side was the left side. No, it's on the right side. Like these, it's all all proper driving except the USA. Yeah. God damn it. Okay. Yep. I go around. What, 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 what was that? Um, what was that, Jazz? Uh, and all of continental Europe. Yeah, we don't count them. We only count England <laughs> and Australia. They're the only countries worth counting. And and and, and England only because they, they agree with Australia in this case. <laughs> in Canada. Right. And all of South America. Okay. <laughs> you yeah, don't count them either. Yeah, and I, I, I'm getting ready to run as a politician. Yeah, still. I've got to do something. I'm, st I'm stuck doing bugger all when it, on this dialysis. Let me tell you. Okay. You, you'd probably um, still get more done. <laughs> what on the dialysis than those politicians? Exactly. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> right. Initiatives, please, people. Um, Doc hasn't gone yet. Uh, oh yeah, oh, sorry. You wanted a you wanted a first aid, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got a first aid. Thank you. That's all right. So initiates. That's a nine for cat. Well, you've got same as you got last time, cat. Well done. So double his. Jazz. Stayed the same. Wow, Babu, Babu, look at you. Babu, Babu, wow. Obviously, uh, <laughs> yeah. Obviously, the obviously the rage is setting in. Speaking of rage setting in, is that everybody? Is everybody except Doc? So I'll let off. And me, because you don't want me to roll. No, well, you're unconscious and you're not there. I'm sorry. I'm not the one who got shot in the back for, or shot in the face or whatever. We have whatever, wherever you got shot from. <laughs> Thorax. Yeah, okay, thank you. Okay. Um, and the 
two. Oh, wow. And oh no, sorry, it wasn't. It was and that was. Uh, and uh, hang on, oh, that's even worse. Uh, yeah, and that one got. Um, okay, let's go. Can I have a spot check, please, Jazz? All right, you spot someone quickly poke his head around that corner and pull it back again. And it was a human head. All right. Um, so Jazz will yell out, what, what, what did he say? Contact south? Contact south, Eddie. Yeah. Contact over. south, 30 meters or whatever, whatever I think that distance is. I forget how, how long it is. It's five meters a square. Oh. So... Yeah, 30 meters is pretty close, actually. Yeah, okay. Th 35 meters. Come back south. And then so, and then Jazz will get ready to, to he'll, he'll keep looking in the arc that he currently has, and just get ready to fire once he actually has a target to shoot at. Right, okay. Well, it's your turn. You don't have a target to shoot at, so what would you like to do? Oh, I thought that was my turn. Um, that's what he does. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. That was pre-your turn. Okay. Uh, then Jazz gets <laughs> keeps looking in the same arc and gets ready to fire when uh, hopefully a target. So you're holding your, you're holding your action, are you? Uh, readying or holding. We're ready, ready, ready holding your action. Yeah, okay, all right. Uh, no, Babu. Babu, grenade away. Okay. So as you lean around the door to sh as you lean around the door to throw your grenade, uh, Robbie was waiting for you and takes a shot at you. Okay. And hits you with his laser rifle. And does 21 points of damage unless you've got an albedo screen, which I believe you said you and did. I had the albedo screen on. Yeah, so that's uh, five, po five points off your power, whatever thing is powering that. Okay. And you can now throw, and obviously you can throw your grenade. I'm assuming you're throwing at Robbie. Uh, where the arrow is. Oh, wow. You are rolling particularly well. Um, right where that arrow is pointing. Is that, is, that, is that where you're throwing it, is it? Yeah. Yeah, that's a shame because they're five metre squares and the radius on the, on the grenade is only three metres, so it fills that square and doesn't hit Robbie. Bugger, he said. Yep. It's, uh, it's been a month. That's okay. I will ready another grenade. I thought you might. <laughs> okay. Uh, you can also give me a quick spot check too, please. Okay. You see somebody poke their human head around that corner. Uh, that uh, not only do they poke their head around, but they also squeeze off um, a gyrojet shot at you. Oh, it's the captain! And he hits you with his gyrojet pistol shot, which does um, gyrojet's two or three. I can't remember. Two, because the rifles is three. Uh, and it actually is a rifle, I should say. So I need to roll another dice. Uh, a total of eighteen points of kinetic damage. Skin suit obviously will protect against that. Alright. Uh, that's him. Voke. I'll throw in my you've own seen, grenade. Hang on, hang on. You've seen, you've seen, um, uh, Babu this, this get shot with a, shot with both a laser blast and a gyro jet shot. Skin suit absorbs oh. half of that, right? Yes, that's right. And I'll it's, look, uh, I'll look in. And I assume I see Robbie. 
You see, you see, Robbie. Robbie takes. Uh, I'm assuming. Sorry, I'm assuming, Babu, you're but you're ducking back around the corner. Yes. All right. Um, well, um, that obviously, as you step forward to take his place, more or less, folk. Uh, Robbie takes his second shot at you and hits for 26 points of laser damage. Okay. And the captain takes his second shot at you and hits for 17 points of kinetic damage. You may now throw your grenade. Okay. Surgery complete. Surgery complete? <laughs> what, did, what, what happened? Did you crack it? Did it just overflow or what's the story? Yeah, let's, it's a can of Oh, let's not, go there. let's not go there. We're in the middle of combat. We're in the middle of combat. Let's not go Can there. I throw it at the corner where the captain is? Can you make a direct line from the doorway? Hang on a sec. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, if he's okay. shooting me, if he's yeah. shooting me from where from the doorway, I can shoot him back. No, it's not quite. The sh that's not always the case. But yes, you can throw a grenade at him. You can throw a grenade there if you can throw a grenade there. And this is from my so uh, uh, rifle, by the way. Okay, it's a what was pretty that? long. Throw. This is from the rifle. Uh, I don't know the grenade launcher ranges. Uh, Give me a second, I'll look it up. What's that? Two? It's a frag. Hang on. Is that a uh, grenade? That's 25, oh. It's 25 plus meters. 25 is fast? short range. 25 is short range. For a thrown grenade? For From a uh, grenade launcher. Grenade. Oh, you got a grenade launcher. Sorry, I didn't realize. Yeah, I took Cerise. By all means. No, I, I thought you were throwing. I didn't realize you were shooting. My, my, my bad. So yes, by all means, yes, you can shoot a grenade, uh, and yeah, they, again, they've only got three meter range, so you want to try and get, yeah. So yeah, that's yeah, yeah. short range. Do I do I get careful aim? No. Oh, that's you unfortunate. Can. Not unless you want to stand there and take a few more shots. Mm, no, no, I do not. Didn't think so. Didn't think so. Let's see, where's the attack? That ain't it. Just roll two D ten. Just roll. There you go. Yeah, uh, no. Nope. Okay, that's a, that's a fair whack off. Um, so uh, roll me a D eight, please. And short range bounce is five meters from memory. Okay, so you're aiming there. Okay, roll me the damage for that frag grenade, please. Well, that's 8d10. That's correct. What the? Well, I mean, guess I hit someone. Not necessarily. The long pauses and uh, the sound of Matt doing math silence yeah i'm pretty sure i hit someone <laughs> what do you mean the sound hey, what do you mean the sound of matt doing doing math in silence Ma math in silence has no sound yeah it exactly. does there's steam coming out your ears oh, I, I, <laughs> I, doubt you that. Hear. I i doubt that my earphones are on which is keeping the steam in place quite nicely thank you <laughs> oh dear Okay, um, and end your turn when you're ready, please, mate. Cat. All right. Um, she doesn't actually know what's around the corner, does she? But she's seen uh, everybody she throw. Gr yeah. She's seen people throw grenades, and she, you've seen two laser shots and two gyro jet shots. Yeah. You do recall teammates. that Jazz yelled contact south. Yeah, and meters. Jazz yelled, yelled contact south. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about. That. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, knowing, knowing all those things, and knowing that she's not a very good throw with grenades, uh, she's probably going to turn around. Uh, and have a peek. Uh, what can she see? She can't see anybody. No, she can't see anybody. 
uh, then she would move forward to that corner uh, and sort of be preparing for somebody to pop around that corner. Yeah. Okay. With with her automatic rifle. She, her basically, automatic rifle. she'd be she'd be readying a burst on someone coming around that corner. Right. Okay. No worries. No worries. So end your turn. Okay. Um. Yep. Okay. Doc, I put you at one because you, we're waiting for you to get back. What was your? You're currently. Yes. You're currently just. You've currently just finished first aiding, Jazz, who is currently out the top of the hatch with the heavy laser. Okay. Is what anyone else hurt? Babu is. Everyone. I mean, everyone uh, everyone's taking crash, damage, including okay. yourself. Including yourself, yeah. All right, we'll do some first aid on Babu then. Okay, so you're moving around to about there then. Put it a little bit closer, but we're running out of space. Um, uh, yes, okay. Uh, you move around, uh, move around to there and ready to do first aid on Babu. No problem at all. Ooh. Yes. Hundred points back. Uh, ten, ten points of first aid back to Babu. No, ten points back. I said, don't be ridiculous. Uh, and I'll get initiatives off everybody again, except for Cerise. Sorry, Cerise. Wow, wow, to go, cat. Uh, so 15 for cat. Where's cat got to? I lost her. Oh, there you are, cat. 15 for cat. And 10 for Jazz. Jazz, 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 Jazz. 10 for Jazz. And 12 for Babu. 12 for Babu. And 13 for Doc. Doc, did you roll? Oh, uh. <coughs> Not that good. Not that good. And I roll for. Well, that's not going to help much. Uh, oh, that's going to help a lot. And that one is... Uh, and that one is... Um, And so is that one. That's everybody. Okay, let's go. Okay. Cat, are you still maintaining your Overwatch? Yep. Well, I got told that there's contact down there, so that's what she'll be doing. Okay. Doc, what are you doing? Now okay. You first added Babu. So, Volk, you're hurt? Uh, yeah. I am. Okay, first aid. Okay. I love combat medics. <laughs> yeah. Ten points back to you. Yes, uh, yes we do. Uh, um, right, right, okay. And Babu, what are you doing? This time I'm going to throw the grenade on Robbie. Okay, so you're leaning around the doorway again. Okay, Robbie was Robbie actually got initiative before you, so he was ready with his next shot, uh, which he does hit you hit again with with the albedo uh, with the laser. So that's another 23 points of damage, which is another five five energy units off your off your screen power, uh, and you may now throw it. Oh my God! You did it again. This time you got. This time you landed right on Robbie, uh, and so you may roll eight d ten damage for Robbie's damage. Did you do that quick? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Robbie takes a lot of damage. Uh, Robbie is not wounded technically, but he's certainly taken some damage. 
uh, and end your turn when you're ready, please. Jazz, are you... And I take it you duck back, back around the corner. Ducking back around, ready in another. Yeah, okay. Uh, Jazz, what are you still maintaining your Overwatch? Uh, yep. Particularly as a spot effect I previously used, so he will. Okay. Okay. Uh, da da da. Okay. This guy leans around the corner and, um, with a, uh, with his laser rifle, uh, takes a, a shot, um, at, um, probably vote the way things are standing there, more or less, um, or even possibly jazz. I'll, in fact, I'll roll it. O odds the jazz. Odds the jazz. Is, it's odds the jazz. So he's shooting at jazz actually. Uh, but before he can get his shot off, because um, you were ready with your with your burst fire cat, you can take your burst fire shot. He has got partial cover, and that ain't gonna hit. In fact, you jam your rifle. Does Jazz get uh, a shot off as well? He does. Jazz or Jason? Yeah. Uh, your rifle is jammed up, J uh, Cat. Yep. Uh, with a critical fail of 98. I'm sorry to say. <laughs> yeah. uh, Jazz, yes, you can take yours because you were ready as well. Okay. Um, does careful aim count in this situation? Uh, yeah. Uh, assuming you were careful aiming. You've yep. been doing it long okay. enough, so... Oh, nice. Ow! Yeah. <laughs> and then Jazz, where's my reload? <laughs> uh, okay, um, you uh, uh, you see, he's got an albedo screen. Um, got it. Still, 67 divided by 5, what's that? Um, 50, 12, 13? 13. 13. 14. 14. Mm. Got a round up. Yep, got a round up. Okay, so that's uh, him. Uh, 14 SEU uh, off his um, uh, uh, out of that many. Uh, and he's shot at you. Uh, misses with the partial cover you've got from the because um, you're only vi you know, visible waist high base basically yep. um, are you wearing an albedo screen uh, yep Uh, your albedo screen um, takes uh, another um, six units of energy. As you get shot in the back. Voke. You don't know about the guy to the north, and you've been concentrating on the doorway, but you have heard the contact south. Okay, can I shoot a grenade at him? Didn't hear the shot from the north? No, no, because you're on this side of the van. You wouldn't have seen it. You wouldn't, have, you, yeah, yeah, you wouldn't have been ready for it. Can I shoot a grenade at the southern guy? Uh, yeah, if you wish. Yeah. How long does it take to reload that thing? It would only have one grenade in it. Yeah, you can, you can reload. You, you can reload and shoot, but you can't move. Yeah, that's the move. Yeah, you get because you get two. You get yeah. You get a, yeah. You can reload and shoot the grenade launcher at the one time. It's one of your actions per two, every every round. Yeah, that thing. Nope. <sighs> roll me d roll me d ten, will you? This could get dangerous. A 
set you up with the internal dice. Oh shit. Uh, you actually um, don't clear that corner. And so the grenade ends up bouncing around amongst you lot. Huh. Well. And uh, let me just see exactly where it's going to end up. Uh, huh. Um, I need I need Cat and Babu and Doc to roll me four D six. Four D six. And then skin suits and other things take No forty ten, sorry. Sorry guys. Was there some kind of reaction speed thing versus for those? No, no. Yeah, only anyway, you know, it's it's cool, mate. Don't worry about it, mate. Uh, and then obviously uh, skin suits and um, uh, inertia screens and things obviously ha will halve that um, if you've got if you've got that those to, to to use up. Otherwise, you take that damage. Which is a pain in the butt. Uh, initiatives, please, everybody. Next round. Well, this is... Ah. Uh, not rolling so well. No, you're not. You're not shooting so well either. Got an eleven. Cat uh, got a fifteen. Uh, and vote got an eleven. All right, the enemy. Oh, okay. And. And and uh, okay, Jazz. Uh, was Jazz able to see the guy at all to the northeast? No, no, he's duck, well, he, he's ducked back around the corner, so, yeah. Okay. Um, so um uh, just, just like, just like Cat's ducked back, back around the corner. I'm assuming. Um, sure. Uh, let me ask this. Would, would Jazz know that the guy is behind that corner, or does Jazz have no clue whatsoever? Jazz got shot in the back. That's what he knows. Okay. Well, I ask because if Jazz has a clue, because I don't know, would Jazz know if this came from the ground or from the roof? Because if it's from the ground, Jazz is going to go out. That's all I. Uh, he thinks it came. I, from I don't the want to metagame. Okay. No, he thinks he came from the ground. Okay. It, so it, then. It, so then Jazz will. Well, from um, ground level duck. anyway. Sure. So then Jazz will duck down. Um, and then move out, um, bringing his um, sonic sword to bear. You're moving out, are you? Yeah, so move out. And where, where are you going from there? Because again, you, you don't know that GH5 is there. But I'm guessing it was from the ground level, so Jazz will just move and then go, uh oh, and then I think that's as far as Jazz can go. Yeah, that's, that's all jazz action. Uh, uh, yeah, that's all that jazz action. But yeah, you basically can see the guy, yeah, you know, hiding behind the, yeah, behind the corner. Yeah. He's got a laser rifle. Um, you can see uh, the um, 
albedo screen shimmer. Yep. And he's also wearing a skin suit. Yep. Um, Jazz will uh, yell here, um, and then also try to rage this round or next round, whichever one. Next round is probably your best bet. Okay. Okay. Cat. Uh, she'll be unjamming her rifle, and that's it. Okay. Uh, this guy uh, leans out around the corner again and um, uh, puts a um, shot into Jazz's back. <laughs> Hits Jazz's back. I don't like you, Jazz. Have you noticed? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, it does 26 points of damage to you. Uh, oh. Of laser, laser damage. Doc. Fresh wounds. Okay, well, I, I was hoping to gain some headway against injury, but it looks like everyone's kind of back a step. Uh, so, Cat is reloading, so. Um, okay, I will. Let's see, I already gave Babu and Voke first aid, so. Is Cat injured? Can I see if Cat is injured? Cat just got a grenade, grenade hit, so like chances are high. Yeah. Okay. So first aid for Cat. And Babu got hit with a grenade as well, so and as well as herself. So. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, that's still okay. Okay. Let me just clarify. Um, Babu's just been rewounded, so you can re first aid Babu and yourself. Uh, yeah, and yourself, for example. Both didn't. Okay. So yeah. So that is that's still that's still a success. So so Cat gets no, get ten points back. Thank you. Okay. All right. Uh Well, you doing, in melee combat with the guy to the north, right? Effectively, yes. Okay. Uh, then I will... Uh, can I go prone and unload a burst uh, to the guy to the south? Have you and got still, your... still get careful aim? No, why, no, no, definitely not. In fact, I'm not even, I don't even know if you can get the burst off because you've got to draw your weapon and go prone. These well, I have my weapon out. No, you... Uh, oh, yeah, the grenade launcher's on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll um, just, uh, I'll go... Hang on, hang on. Are you using the, you're using the grenade launcher only, are you? I was. No, the well, grenade launcher is attached yeah, to Yeah, it's the... attached to, to my rifle. Right, in that case, yes, you can go prone and you can do a burst or a single shot. Okay. But you can't get careful aim Oh yeah, that's right, you can't do careful. Apologies. That's alright. And I believe that's medium range? With a automatic? Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, it's over 30, 35, call it 35 meters, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, yeah, 35 meters, and he's got partial cover. Okay, now that's still... Pardon me. Whoops, only take the first... Okay, the first one hit. Okay, well, 5d10 damage. And that was with a... Uh, a what, uh, automatic uh, rifle. Um, yeah, automatic rifle, thank you. So 13 for him and 13 for his skin suit. Okay. Babu, 
from your position to the uh, south side of the of the door way, yeah. Babs? Yeah, yeah. Sorry. From your position, don't fall asleep on me. From your position, south <laughs> south of the doorway, all right, I need, you, I, I need you to give me a quick spot check, please. A quick search roll. Yep. Um, you see that door uh, 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 open somewhat, and uh, you can see a guy behind it who uh, takes uh, aim at you uh, with an automatic rifle and uh, squeezes off two shots. Uh, first one hits, the second one doesn't, so that's two points of kinetic damage. And he's using the doorway's cover in a similar way that you are. Alright. So I believe it's your turn, Babs. Uh, I wanted a grenade to Robbie. Okay, well, again, Robbie got a very good initiative, so he gets his shot of his laser shot off at you first. And again hits you for twenty seven points of laser damage. At six charges, right? Yeah, that's six charges at 27. And you may throw your grenade. And you oh. missed. Can you give me... It's uh, Well, it doesn't matter where it's going to land. It's going to land outside Robbie. So it's not, it's not going to affect Robbie and there's no one else in range in where Robbie is. So don't worry about rolling damage and the rest of it. Just end All your right. turn. Pick Please. Okay, he does that. Um, okay, uh, the guy you're fighting, um, Jazz. Mm -hmm. um, he drops his drops his rifle, draws his um, electric sword and takes a swipe at you with an electric sword uh, and misses which is not surprising so I'll get initiatives, initiatives off everybody please That's a nice one, baby. Yeah. What can I do with it? That's the question. Well, you, you, uh, yeah. I don't know. That force axe is looking pretty good. I'm kind of thinking that, but I got an AR rifle covering me now too. Yeah, I know. It's one of those. It's one of those terrible situations, isn't it? Cat, 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 cat. There you are, cat. Does. Anyone have smoke grenades? Uh, yeah, we. It's so, everybody. You know, smoke around. grenades are tear gas, basically. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Pretty much. When you ask for a smoke grenade, you you're asking for tear gas. It's not. Not all. Not necessarily. There's the nightfall, I think, is what the... Nightfall is the smoke, I think. Right. Robbie did very well again. Um, and so, uh, we'll start with Jazz. Alright, Jazz will try to rage. Oh. And then Jazz will swing at the guy with his sign sword. For 30 points. 
points of sonic damage. What a son the sonic Sorry. sword does five d ten, does it? Uh, yeah. I can double wow. check that. Sonic sword, Please. five d ten. Okay. Second um, to uh, four sacks. Was that why you took it? Yeah, that and the fact that it's sonic. All right. Well, uh, that guy is now dead, actually. Oh. Didn't expect that. But I'm happy to hear. You didn't expect it, but you're happy to hear it. Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Uh, Babu's going to get some first aid. Babu's going some first aid. And Babu gets some first aid with the same role as last time, funnily enough. Uh, yep. Okay, Babu. Been fun, guys. What happened? Oh, <laughs> You're charging Robbie, are you? Yes, I am. And once he gets his shot off, I'll swing at him. Hang on. Uh, he misses. Poor thing. Poor thing. But the captain... Also misses. I don't believe that. Okay. Um, yep, go for your life, mate. And no. you miss. You miss as well. So close. So close, but not so but so far away. Let's put you a little bit further in. Well be, yeah. Mm. Cat? Cool. Uh, she'll put a burst on the guy that's down there. Can she see him, or is he poking? Yeah, no, he's, the... yeah. He's a like, bit like you, a bit around, you know, leaning around the corner, taking pot shots. Um... If you don't get a shot now, you get a shot as soon as he leans out, you know, so take it now. Yeah, okay. And it's a burst, is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, you peg him well and truly. Okay. Uh, that's 14 for him, 14 for the skin suit, and he had 14 off his albedo screen, so 14's all around. <laughs> uh, when you, and you finish your turn when you're ready, mate. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Doc, you take a single automatic rifle round uh, for a single point of damage. Um, that's kinetic damage. Uh, Cat, you take one in the back for three points. Uh, okay. Um, so, yeah. Um, and, uh, this guy, again, um, let's see if we can see you guys. Yeah, he's, he's got, he's got a, he's got a line on cat, so he's going to shoot at cat with his laser rifle. Uh, and, oh, just hits by a percentage point. Um, so that's, um... 30 points of laser damage. And then we'll move on to Vac. Alright. Uh, I will unload another burst. At the guy at the south? Yeah. Yep, go for life. He has soft cover. He has half cover, soft cover, yes. Yeah, uh, no, that one. Mm. No, 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 no. Yeah. 
Um, and so that's an issue, please, people. Babu's gone eight ship. Yes, yes, he yeah. has. Yeah. Jazz hasn't gone eight ship, which is unusual because it should be the other way around. Uh, cat, 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 cat stays the same. Doc stays the same. Babu, Babu, well done, Babu. Still stays about the same. Yeah, you know, well, it depends what the other Order stuff, wise. Cat, Jazz gets a 14. And Vote gets a 15. You all did very well that round in terms of things. And I've only got to, ro I've got to roll one less initiative now. Oh, what a shame. Uh, to you. <laughs> and, um, oh. And, oh, Robbie got 17 again. So, Robbie uh, swings at you with both of his arms. Striking twice. Uh, the first one does uh, 12 points of kinetic, and the second one does 15 points of kinetic damage. That's against you, Babu, of course. Vote, you're up. This guy's still, still exposed. I'm going to try a grenade this out. Okay. Nope. D8, please. Okay, my mouse. Sorry, my mouse is having problems. That's right. And you do exactly the same thing you did last time. Clip the building and possibly get... <laughs> of my mouse, my toilet for your mouse. Yep, you bet. You get you get these two again. And Doc, Cat, another 40, 10 of kinetic damage to yourselves, please. Each. Okay, no more grenades. It's the uh, Ghost of Cerise is pissed at you for using uh, her grenades. Okay, I got a console. Well, it is Cerise's grenade launcher, yeah, so I'll blame it on the... Yeah, just roll that up. Just roll that, ma uh, add that up manually, if you're in your head. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll look into that. I got the same error. I'll roll it again, either way. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't appear, so... I didn't know yeah. what I rolled. Oh, it appeared at my end. Okay, what was total. it? It was a 4, 10, 7, and 8. Which comes okay. out twenty nine. Um, yeah. Okay, so vote again. Your turn, please. Okay. Um, vote. Uh, sorry, vote. Uh, the guy around the corner is going to shoot at vote because he doesn't like grenades, even if they even if they don't hit. I am prone, by the. Way. I know, and that's why he missed, and the only reason he missed the extra bit of being prone. Jazz. Alright, Jazz is going to run straight south in a dodging manner. Well, if you're, if you're dodging, whatever your run rate is, you know. Um, you know what? He won't dodge. He'll just run straight south. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it doesn't quite get to him, but it's yeah. pretty much a target. I'll, um, even put, I'll, put you, I'll, even put you, I'll even put you there if you want. Uh, nah, it's okay. So, uh, well, okay, sure. It's not, it's, not melee, it's not melee yet, but what you have done is you've blocked everybody's line of sight. But that's okay. Doc? That's fine. And then and as Jazz runs down that way, um, Jazz will yell, No more grenades! Help! Help! Um, Babu. Yeah, no more okay, grenades well, is enough. The duck's in Doc? B bad shape, so he's gonna first aid give himself? himself some first aid. 
<laughs> Guy feel on. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. That's a foul. That you was about to, that was bound to happen. It was ten points of damage to yourself, mate. Okay, I'm unconscious. Own, and Doc goes unconscious. Th you hear a thump behind you, cat. <laughs> awesome. Someone told you I was quick. <laughs> Babu. All right, so Robbie should already swung at me, right? Yeah, Robbie's had his go at you in terms of uh, melee combat, so you can have a melee uh, combat back at him if you want. Yeah, I could, or could I just run away from him now? Oh, he'll get a free attack if you run, run away from him. But he's already had his attack. He'll get. You'll still get a free freebie if if you run away. Yeah, I'm running. Okay. Where are you running to? Oh, okay. Interesting. And the freebie at you misses from Robbie. I, that was about okay. 5, 10, 15 meters. 5, 10, 15, uh, call it 15, 20 can, meters, yeah. Actually, okay. So I can still... I engage that guy. Move far enough to engage him. Well, he's using he's using the door as cover, so you're gonna have to bash your way through the door. At him. All right. So hit him. Hit the door and him. Yeah. If you want to give me a strength roll, for a, a, a strength. Yeah, you know, it's a bash. So give me a strength roll. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. You you hit the door at a hard run. The door flashes smashes back into this guy's face. Um. And does. Eight points of damage to him, which he's not ready. He's not ready for. He. Let me see what happens. What else happens? He might actually go. Um, let me just check. Uh, yes, he's gone. Pr he's been knocked back prone on his ass, and he's lost his rifle. Uh -huh. In the in the thing. Can mm -hmm. I make sure his uh, chest armor works? Uh, no, not this round. Not no, all right. No, 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 not not with all the rest of it going on, but yeah. Okay, Cat, you're up. I'll be right back. All right, mate. All right. So what do I know? I know Jazz is in front of me, so I can't shoot that guy anymore. I heard the dock fall over, so probably what I'll do is I'll turn around and slap a Stato's patch on the dock, so the dock doesn't get any worse. Uh, and that will be my turn. All right, I'm back. Um, I'm not sure if you're on mute. Oh, sorry. I'll start again. Uh, the the guy uh, the the guy's been knocked flat on his back. Uh, this this guy's been knocked straight flat on his back, um, so he doesn't get a go. Um, so uh, that'll be initiative from people, please. Is what I asked for when I was muted. Sorry about that. Does that does you have a chance to stand up though this turn? Or is this sorry, just wrong? sorry. What was that? I missed I missed that, Jazz. Um, the guy that that boot just like knocked over. G -W G -Y -4. GY4. GY4. Uh, did he get a chance yeah. to stand up or it's still prone? No. No, no, he's still prone. He lost it. He was stunned. He was, I mean, you, no. You, who expects a small, a small, a small, um, Dralocyte to come barreling through the door at you? <laughs> they always underestimate Babu. They do. They do. Jazz got a nine. Jazz, where are you, Jazz? There you are. Jazz got a nine. I've got Vote got a seven. Doc's unconscious. Sorry, Doc. And these guys. Let me think. Uh, let me roll these dice first. And then we'll see what the issues are like, and then we'll go from there. So the captain got a um, and um, and 
Jazz got a nine. No, no, I did that, didn't I? Uh, he got a because uh, he's so screwed. And Robbie, for once, didn't get the highest. Okay, so uh, let's get this show on the road. Uh, this guy, uh, again, he drops his laser rifle, draws his electric sword, and takes a swing at you, Jazz. And hits you. Anyone remember what an electric sword does? Save me looking it up. Uh, I'll look it up. No, that's right, I've got it here. Four, is it? I thought Four it was die ten. Yeah. With an asterisk. Uh, and so that will do 19 points of uh, damage to you with his electric sword. Um, gauze screens will protect you. That's, the, that's about the only thing, I think. Yeah. Unless it was on set on stun, which I assume it was not. No, it's not set on stun. It's set on kill. <laughs> kill. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Set on kill. Cat! Uh, okay, so she's applied the Stados to the dock. Uh, she probably needs to follow in Boo-Boo's footsteps now. Um, she has no idea what's in there, so she'd be going up to the door fairly cautiously. Uh, and if something's there, she'd fire a burst on it. Right, well, what you can see is Robbie. Hi, Robbie. And you said you were going to fire a burst at Robbie. So that's 510. Robbie's not. Got, Robbie hasn't got cover. Nice. And Robbie has taken some damage, you can see. So that's a critical hit. That's yep. a critical hit. So we double that to 54 points. Okay, Robbie is sparking badly. Great chunks are torn out of his... Uh, 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 great chunks are torn out of his um, casing. Right? One of his arms looks a bit limp, but he is still operational. So he looks like uh, Johnny Five at the end of Short Circuit Two, pretty much. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Still going. Yeah. Still going, but pretty, pretty. He's pretty badly gone. Um, this guy leans around the corner and takes a pot shot at you. Uh, with his Gyrojet rifle. Hits once. And the second shot also hits. Um, so that's, um, the first one is. 24 points of kinetic, and the second one is 27 points of kinetic. Cool. Babu. Man. Oh, I got to a swing. No, well, this guy's prone, don't forget, so uh, that's an advantage to you. You've got height advantage, in other words, you know. Uh, if there's nothing in the in the, I can't think, I can't remember if there's anything in the modifiers list. Just give yourself a yeah, plus ten. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, just give yourself, just give yourself a plus ten. Oh, target's prone. Plus five. Plus five. Or might well, that's harder to hit. So minus no, melee that, that, target oh, yeah, that stun. Be for shooting, shouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's for shooting. Yeah, Ma Marty target stun. That's it's minus twenty. Stun. Smack him real good. Minus twenty. Oh yeah, melee, melee target stun. Doesn't even matter. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Well, roll your damage. Oh. Uh, force act nineteen. Not the best. Yeah. Um, but with the, uh, but with the, uh, previous, um, shrapnel he damage he took from a frag grenade, that puts him dead. Oh, is that the guy he hit? I don't know, but he's, 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 he's got trap, he's got some damage to him. Hey, yeah. that's the guy. 
jazz. <laughs> um, I forget. Careful aim does not apply to melee, correct? No, not for melee. <laughs> gotcha. All right. So jazz will swing his sword. Sun sword. Mm -hmm. That's a hit. Not, not the best. So that's exactly uh, what he did to Jazz. The same round. It was. Do you get a bonus on um, that? Um, he is wounded but uh, not dead. No strength bonus on um, the Sun and Sword. Ah. Uh. Misses with one swing of his arm. Robbie, this is. Misses with the second swing of his arm. Babu. Voke. Uh. You're prone, don't forget. Yeah, I'll stand up, reload, uh, and... Uh... And that's it. And that's it. Okay. And this is please, people. Unchanged for Babu. Jazz, you're up. Uh, Jazz will swing again. Nice. nice. He's dead. He's dead. Don't worry. Yeah, <laughs> no, roll it. I mean, it is, it is, it is, it is actually possible you'll roll low, low enough you'll survive. Yeah, no. no. Didn't stop. <laughs> <laughs> um, does Jazz have a movement left, or is that his entire turn? Uh, no, that, well, in a melee combat like that, that would be his, 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 basically his, his entire turn, yeah. Okay. Um, the captain's going to shoot it, shoot through the doorway at, at Cat again. Cat by now has pulled back a little bit, so he's got some cover. Uh, uh, and actually critically fails, and so jams his rifle and loses his next, his next, he's got to unjam his rifle. Rob? is going to swing at Babu again with his fists. Uh, one hit, two hits. First, whoops, it is it. First one, oh, for God's sake. First one does 17 points of kinetic and the or impact, same thing. Ignore that. And the second one does um, 11 points of kinetic. Cat, you're up. She has to reload, so she'll be reloading. And pulling back, I'm assuming, at the same time. And going in. Yeah, is that right? Is that right? Uh, no, she'll well, going be in. going, going in. to that okay. corner there, taking cover. Mm -hmm. Okay. End your turn. Babu? Hold on one minute. I'm calculating stamina. Uh oh. Alright. I'm still good, but I'm, I'm swinging at him now. 
you're obviously wounded though, so you don't have to take the wounded You bonfire. are wounded. What is the definition that's, of that? Uh, that's ten. The definition is half half your hip, half your center point's gone. Oh, uh, one to, point under that, so I am wounded now. Uh, in that case, you have minor, in that case, you got to put an extra minus ten on your on every action. On everything, every action, every skill test, everything. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. God, I tell you, the dice love you today, James. Seriously. They do. Yes, yes, they do. Uh, except for and that one. And Robbie, Robbie's cleaved in two by a force axe. Folk. I'll uh, use the door as cover, and uh, I will unload a burst of. Okay. Uh, so I think that. How far is that? What thirty-five? Yeah, that's thirty-five. Yeah, thirty-five. Just barely hit. Oh wait, does he have cover? So no, sorry, he's got partial cover. So no. okay, so not that missed. That's all right. Cerise. Oh, hang on, sorry, Cerise. Okay. Initiate, initiate, please, guys. Let's hit it, Jazz. Oh, hang on, that's not right. Sorry, hang on. Hundred and twenty-three. No, 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 no. Let's hit. Let's hit it, Voke. He's on fire. All right, I'm gonna unload another. Nope, I missed. Mm-hmm. Go you back behind Babu? the door. What do you do? Now you don't know what's going on out in the corridor. Don't forget, Babu. Don't yeah, but see. I am thinking that Babu would question whether that door to his now right leads to a way to flank the captain. You, we so were, you, we've been turn in turn that and room slowly before. Slowly open it and look inside. All right, slowly open look inside. There is nothing inside apart from furniture and that, but, and you, yes, you can see the door on the far side. All right, and next turn I'll move that way. Well, you move that way now if you want. I think I was kind of cautious and not knowing okay, what's no, going to happen, no. so. Fair enough. No, that's cool. I'm, I'm, thank you for being, for, for playing honestly. Jazz. Uh, Jazz will run. All right. Now, don't forget, Doc's lying on the ground. Yep. So Jazz spots Doc lying on the ground, and Jazz runs over to Doc. All right. Well, next time you can do something. Cat, you're ready, re ready and reloaded. Uh, yep. Uh, she'll pop around the corner, and put a burst on the captain. Okay. He's got partial cover, and you'll have partial cover when he shoots back at you. Because he will shoot back at you. <laughs> yep, that's a hit. 5 to 10 damage, please. Oh. Okay. Does he have a shimmer around him? No, he does not. Oh, so he's an inertia then. Right? I refuse to answer that on the grounds I'm gonna criminate myself. <laughs> okay. Uh he shoots back at you. Oh wow. Critic a definite critical hit. What are your stamina points looking like? Apparently has 27, but I'm guessing what she's going to have less than zero soon. Yeah, because you just took 26, all right, from the first one. 
and if you're still on your feet, I'll need you to give. If you're still on your feet after that, I'll need you to give me a current stamina check to not go unconscious. Because I got a, I got a two, which be, which which could knock you out, no matter what. Well, that's 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 not going to happen. Have, oh, right, because why? You're unconscious, aren't you? Well, I uh, I would it would it would be a one out of a hundred chance of s surviving yeah. that. Yeah, and you take a further seventeen points from the second shot. Cool. Well, my body computer kicks in and uh, in minutes. Yeah, I thought it both, was both a stim dose and a stay dose. The stim dose is completely useless, but it would do so. Oh well. Yeah, it would do so nonetheless. That's okay, and uh, that's a good thing you do it because it, that's that everything's going to stabilize you basically for the time being. You didn't have so a skin suit, did you? No, it was all destroyed from getting shot twice with a grenade. Yeah, well, <laughs> not my grenade launch. <laughs> so, Voke did aiming. more damage. Voke did more damage to the party than he yes, did I know. the enemies. I know. This, this I know. Um. <laughs> yes, I've noticed that. Uh, initiatives, please. Are they still on their feet? The the, the car crashed did quite a bit of um, bit of damage all around as well. Well, that was a critical fail, and then the first grenade was a critical fail. <laughs> and the the dice the love the other Dralocyte tonight, okay? That's not supposed to be a 15. That is supposed no, to be a 15. That's supposed to be not... There's yeah. a reason we're called the budget team. The dice like the uh, the Dralocyte that wears clothes tonight. So what should, what should your initiative be, Vogue, on that roll? 13. 13 total, right. Yeah. Okay, and the captain's got a... Jazz? Okay. If we survive this one, let's see if we can get some type of film right. And, you know, who would believe a group like this, you know? <laughs> jazz, you're up. Uh, jazz, if I first date to the dock. Okay. And no succeeds. No, yeah, succeeds. So ten points back, Doc. Are you are you on positive hit points yet? I Can am now. Yet? You am now. Then you then you wake up. So you better give me a you better give me an issue of roll as well, please. But I'll cap you at sixteen. Not that it makes a difference. Uh. Well. Voke. Launch a grenade, go on. <laughs> <laughs> that. Yeah, yeah, TPKs are supposed to be the GM's responsibility, not the players. No, I'll stay behind the door and reload. Okay. Back to bullets for me. Not grenade bullets, regular smaller bullets. Okay. Doc? What do you 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 come you come out out of your grogginess? What happened? Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's on his ass. I think that's where he's gonna stay for the moment. Both uh, Voke and Jazz can get uh, first aid. Mhm. Mm Which way does the door open? And uh, actually, no, I cannot get first aid. Start I got open first it slowly and without disturbing the captain. Concentrating mm -hmm. around the other corner. Well, it opens towards you and swings to the north. So yeah, you can put your head out the door and see the captain standing there, and he wouldn't—he he doesn't know, does not appear to know you were there. You Works for me. Not on, no, it's not on mute. Good. Uh, is that—is is that your action? Yeah. Okay. Initiatives, please, people. I can see someone getting a force axe in the back here. I think maybe. Uh, Doc, your initiative, please, mate. Excellent. Doesn't change. Still groggy. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, Jazz. 
uh, Jazz will apply first aid to himself. To himself? Okay. Yeah. Ten points back. Voke, what are you doing? You're next. Captain's got so got half cover, soft cover. Half okay, cover. I'll do another burst. Okay. Which I believe just cancels out. Yeah. Missed. Babu. Oh, so much fun. Uh, do you believe I caught him from behind? Uh, Attacking well, from yeah. behind? That is a minus 20 for you. But you're wounded, so it's a that offsets is minus ten. Ah! Oh. You missed. Almost. You missed. He caught. He heard you at the last moment and dodged out of the way. That's fine. He's got a choice now. Oh, that's that's no choice at all. Um, the captain uh, drops his laser rifle, uh, draws his sonic sword, and has a swing at you. And gets you. Uh, 44 d6 with 40-10 we said for Sonic Sword? Yeah, 40-10. 4 or 5? 5 to 10. Uh, the Sonic. Sats is the only one that does 5. No, Sonic Sword also does 5. Are you sure about that? Yep, Sonic nice. Sword, 5 d10. My Sonic Sword is only 4. What? Your Sonic Sword is four. type four. wrong. The electric sword does four die ten. Yeah. Twenty six twenty six points of sonic damage. Evoke. Oh. Uh and and you guys can no longer see the captain around the corner because you know. But you can hear grunts of a melee of some sort of melee combat going on. Doc Okay. Uh Jazz looks wounded, so no, uh, yeah, uh, the other thing, the other thing is, the other thing is, cat, cat looks wounded and, and is lying on the on the corridor in, inside the complex too. You can see. Yeah, and, and you just yeah. saw Jad apply first aid to himself. Yeah, but the doc's on his knees and groggy. Okay, no, fair enough. If that's what you want to do, I'm just just making sure you're aware of the situation. That's all. So you want to, you want to. But who are you doing first aid to? Jazz. But, no, J but can't. Jazz, Jazz has already been first Jazz doesn't qualify. Okay, so I guess then it was Volk. I already Volk. got first. points back, Volk. Then Volk I don't do anything. Thing. You don't do anything. Okay. okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, okay, initiatives, please, people. This could be telling between between Babu and the t captain. Yep. Oh, Babu. That's the one time you didn't want to do that. You wouldn't didn't want to, want to have that to happen. Yes. Don't worry. The captain's going to miss. Jazz. Uh, Jazz. I, I yeah. bet you... What do I have to bet? I don't have... Jazz will run. And... A flashlight. Mm -hmm. I can bet you a flashlight. Yeah, it's all right, Ryan. So Jazz will run it there. Um, okay. And uh, on the way there, see Cat on the ground and yell, "Doc, Cat's down." Which is fair enough. Both. Ah. Uh. Well, all right. I'll join the melee. I'll pull out my you four sets. Oh, you... Pull out your four sets. Yes. And if I run, does that mean I have to do a reaction speed? No. Why would you? Uh, to fumble it. 
No, that's fine. Is that where you're running to? I run. Okay, can you make it that far? Yeah, that's 25. Yeah, okay, a little over 25, but close enough. Okay, end your turn if that's it. And uh, I shout, uh, he has an, in he doesn't have a, I think he has an inertia screen. <laughs> okay, uh, swings his sonic sword, strikes with his sonic sword. Damn it, I does, was wrong. Does 16 points of damage with his sonic sword to you. Ben who uh, stop any of that? Not against, not against sonic sword, no, sonic yeah, screen will stand Babu is thing. down. Their boo is down. Well, these guys don't know that, but that's all right. Doc, what are you doing? Okay, as you are. stumbles to his feet. Barely gets over to where Cat is. Sticks a needle in her arm. Down. Okay. Successfully, it turns out. Yeah, Ten very points successful. back, Cat. Does that put you on your feet? Nope. Nope. But you are you you are not dying though. Not that you were dying anyway, but yeah. I was already and not bad. dying, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. Wait, Kat, are you up now or no? Nope. And oh. Babu, you're down too, you said you said I'm at right? I'm at uh well positive three now, but yeah, negative three hit points. Negative three hit points, Damn yeah, it. that's okay. Damn it's demo, yeah. So initiative please guys. Oh, that's not good. Uh, Jazz is on 16. Way to keep up that Dralocyte roll. Yeah. 14, <laughs> for, 14 for Doc. And 6 for Voke. Okay. I'm about to get, like, friggin' shot. Yeah, you are. To, to smithereens. It's not going to be good. Okay. Let's go. Jazz. Um, Jazz is Sonic Sword is out of power, so he's going to reload. You're going to reload? Is that what you're doing? Reload, okay. reload a Sonic Sword. Um, do okay. I still have some movement? You can move if you wish. All right. Um, yeah. No, he'll, he'll kind of see Volk there. doesn't want to get break line of sight with Volk, so we'll just reload. Um, <laughs> and then, but he doesn't want to get out of cover yet either, so just reload. Just reload? Okay. You can just reload. We'll let you do that. Doc, okay, what do you do? Well, uh, I... Hold on. Okay, uh, yeah, the Doc's got fire in his eyes, and he's really pissed off now, so he's going to start r running forward. Okay, where are you going to run to? The Doc is welcome to that way. One, take one of Jazz's non-lethal weapons if he wants. Yeah, okay. End your turn then, please, Doc. Okay. Um, I need a reaction speed check at the moment. Okay, yep, good. <laughs> um, the captain uh, leans around the corner with his gyrojet rifle and takes a single shot at Voke and actually misses. Voke, you're up. All right, I uh, realize, wait a second, what I just said made sense. I drop the four sats uh, and I pull out my sonic sword. Okay. <laughs> Is that your... I, I, I got it. Uh, yeah, all right. Or bears, either word. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, it doesn't make much difference. And then okay, initiative, initiative, please, guys. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, that's, gonna be good. that's good for me. Well, good for him, anyway. Oh, great. I'm gonna get. Yeah, you get smacked, eh? Okay. Yeah, you are. So he drops his rifle again, redraws his uh, his uh, sonic sword, and swings at you, Voke. 
Oh god, and misses. I can't believe that. Actually misses. Yeah, well, oh. I'm not great yeah. at melee combat, so... Jazz, you're up. Um, Jazz, seeing that both Oak and Doc are going down this way, um, figures he'll kind of... Well, oh, and you see, but by, by the way, Voke, you see, you see um, Babu on the floor. Babu, I need you to lose a point of stamina. Got it. Good. So, Jazz, you're going to go Is for that going to be one you? every turn, then? One every turn at the end of every turn. That was for the end of every last right. end of last turn. Um, Jazz, I, I now, would Jazz go through the door to the north? Come on, quick, 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 All quick. Right. Six seconds. All right. Jazz will run through the door to the north then. Two, okay. Four, well, the door to the five. north is off its hinges, so you can get to <laughs> there. You get to, so, hang on, you get to there quite easily. Are you going through that door as well? We've, we've kind of been through this area before. Yeah, we have. Yes. And okay, that, so. th that door's open and so is the far door, but it, you, it, you, you know. Let's so. just keep running. Yeah, well, you're to about there with all the okay. dodging the furniture and things like that. And you see sure. Babu on the ground, on the ground, leaking fluid. I won't call it blood, because he doesn't have any. Uh. Oh, he Jazz will yell out, Babu's down. Okay, okay, so Doc has got visions of his rugby teammates from his past before medical school. So he wants to rush around the corner here and try to just bull rush the captain. You're going to crash tackle to, Okay. You could try to wrestle him. A, yeah, it's a running it's a leap, basically. perhaps? Yeah, yeah. That's, no, just uh, give me... It's a melee attack. It's a bull rush attack, as you said. Or, uh, yeah. It's, it's technically... If, if you've got wrestling skill, and I don't think you do, do you? No. Or no. martial artists, I think, is what it is. Martial but arts. Wrestling is just a one. melee attack. Yeah. Exactly. You're just... But no, you, you 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 are not you are not successful in your in your grapple. Uh, but so you end up basically on the other side of him as he sides <laughs> All right, I take my attack with my son, and I miss. Oh. And you miss, and that's everybody. So initiatives, please. Uh, better, but not good enough. Okay. Don't a nine for Vogue. A fifteen for Jazz. That might do something. All right. Am I looking for a certain number to tell you when I reach? Uh, yeah. Minus ten. You uh, minus thirty. You're dead. All right. Minus uh, twenty-five is we have to put you in a freeze field. Well, before minus thirty. Yeah. Um. Okay. Jazz, you have got the initiative, all right? Charging in on the captain is not an option because Babu is basically blocking you because, you know, you can get to him, you can't charge him. Does that make sense? But I can just walk up to him and swing, right? Yeah, that's fine. You just, you couldn't, I'm just saying you can't do a charge because Babu's okay. lying on the ground in front of you, in front, you know, and he's ineffectively blocking you. Okay. Right. So Jazz will just walk up to him and it's just attacking so from you, behind. Yeah, yeah. All right. Okay. What was that with? Sonic Sword. Sonic Sword. Oh, you bastard, he says. <laughs> Sucks, <laughs> don't it? Um, oh, Do that in a Cartman, Cartman voice? You bastard! <laughs> oh, awesome. Does that help? Okay, thank you. That's right. Um, he's heavily wounded. He's incredibly heavily wounded now. From that, um, he takes a swing at Voke because he may as well, and hits Voke with the Sonic Sword, and does 19 points of Sonic damage to you. Voke, you're up. Hey, I hit. And, he's, and, he's, <laughs> and, he go, and, he, and he goes down. He only had one point left. Doesn't matter what you roll. He only had one point left. Nice. So, yeah. uh, so that's the captain gone. I Doc, think what would you like Babu's to do? leaking on the floor, so 
Babu is leaking on the floor. Babu is no longer leaking on the floor. Ten points back, Babu. Is that put, does that put you on your feet? Yeah, uh, plus five or yeah, okay. negative five, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're, yeah, you're, yeah. On five, okay. I'm um, on the living side at five. How's that? You're on the living side at five. And so what uh, do you want if to do now? Uh, are we still doing turn by turn? Uh, not necessarily. It depends what you want to do. Uh, I put a status in the cap. No, he's dead. Negative. He's at negative twenty, right? He's dead. Dead. Okay. Okay. So apart from that, what do you guys want to do? Um, look for the medical. Gotta find the med bay. First, we gotta secure the comp. So okay. first, let's get um, everyone get some first aid going. We gotta get cat secure. Then the four of us need to secure the comp. Unfortunately, the plumber's here. I gotta go. Sorry, guys. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> User disconnected from your channel. For, for a minute there, I thought that sounded like some kind of uh, code phrase, like in-game code phrase. Mm -hmm. Are you still with us, Dan? I'm assuming you are. Uh, yeah, Dan? Might be on mute if you are. Ryan, is it still there? Away. Ryan? Uh, yep, sorry. Is your dad still there? Uh, somewhat. Do you he want to take over Doc while we're waiting? While he's waiting? I think he's coming back. That's okay. Anyway. Come on, guys. What do you want to do? Um, so, first thing is... Well, if we're going to kind of hunker down and secure the place, um, I would suggest that we kind of set ourselves up in this room. So we'll move Cat's body into this room. Okay. And well, then I think as a group, we'll kind of clear out each of the rooms and check yeah. out each of the rooms. Yeah. All right. So, where you are now is a, it, it, where you are now contains a, a, a large number of bunks. Um, it's probably the workers' barracks room. Okay. Yep. All right. So, first room. Let's just do this one because we're right by it. Whoa. That's sorry. Wow. No, you, no, you're not that big. I hit the wrong button. No. <laughs> I think he's ready. Um, stop, 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 stop. <laughs> there we go. Thank you. That's all right. Uh, the next room, that room there, yeah, is a dining hall and contains four service spots. Uh, and a number of tables and that. Wait, that's a server the room? The bots are not. No, it's sir, no it's the dining room. Ah. The dining hall. Okay. And the bots are not reacting to us. And the bots are not reacting to you, no. Well, they are. Sure. They, they're they're moving to get. They're moving to uh, serve you food. Like uh, that is both that the first half of that room, the one you just moved into there, um, uh, contains um, uh, the subspace radio and some supplies. The back half appears to be a um, a, a med bay area, which can be screened off by collapsing doors and hopefully sterilised. Okay. Um, I guess we'll move south because it's closest. Uh, that is uh, the reactor, the a the reactor room, which is what you were supposed to be disabling in the first place. Okay. Then I guess there are two remaining rooms up to the north. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's the machine shop. Heavy equipment. Um, uh, yeah. And don't forget, there's a large, there's a large set of double doors to the north. Are there any vehicles in this one? No, but there's room for vehicles. They're probably out with the miners. Uh, we don't see any miners around here. 
No, there's no mic. There's no other personnel around. No. Uh, that is um, a uh, um, uh, probably the guard room because it contains bunks, chairs, and tables. Uh, there's and there's a locker near each bunk. All right. Um, so seems clear. So I would propose we get um, the dock cat. And oh, by the way, in the sorry, by the way, in the workers' barracks room, there was a level two computer. Not that's going to do much good for you. And the other one you got is the supervisor's room, which is a small square, the four, the square one. Uh, it's got, again got some bunks and um, yeah, that's other bits and pieces in it. All right. So I, I figure like the lockers and then all the equipment on the on the dead bodies will will kind of gather all that stuff up um, after we get cat. On her feet. All right, so, well, you're in a med bay, so you're plus 20 to any surgery roll anyone cares to make. So who so, needs what? So, so Jazz is going to assist you. Uh, so Cat... Cat... Well, should we just start and there's enough, And there's enough, and there's enough medical supplies here not to worry about medical, the medical supplies. Well, do you need okay. assistance if you have minus 20? With the med bay? Yeah, always. Always get assistance if you can get it. Well, I mean, it's just another chance for someone to roll a crit fail, right? What's, yeah. Well, but... assistance with a crit fail and assistance doesn't do anything bad. I mean, Wait, my major it? surgery is 110. So yeah. you're fine unless I crit fail. So does assistance help reduce crit fail? Not really, no. So then you don't need assistance. Right. Because that's just another chance to crit fail. Alright, so here is Cat. Okay, Cat, um, major surgery. Cat, you're you're fully healed. And he's away, oh. from, he's away from the computer. Oh, now you're back. Okay, who else needs healing? And we're going, I'm assuming we're leaving Cerise to laugh. Because Cerise isn't actually there yet. Uh, need Vogue will work. need. Uh, yeah, Vogue needs surgery. Major, major surgery? or minor? Uh, I need. Well, I need first aid and a minor. That'll be good enough. First aid or minor? That was the minor. Yeah, and there's the first aid. Okay, so you back. You get another thirty points back. Okay, does that put you on full? Or close enough to uh, two, two below full. Yeah, okay. So, I'm good. so that's, that's you. What about that's Vogue? Uh, what about you, Doc? How are you going? Let me look. Uh, yeah, his he needs it. Major surgery. Yeah, well, major surgery yourself then. So what's that doing surgery on yourself? Is that minus? No, it's yeah, nothing. It's, it's the same. You, it's a normal, normal roll. The auto surgeon helps out. Okay. And now you're on full. Jazz. And jazz. jazz will also need uh, major surgery. Jazz needs major. Mm-hmm. Yep. So I take it the compound is fairly secure. Oh, apart from the hole in the fence. Well. And uh, yeah, so and you're on full hit points too. Couple of doors too, knocked down. Couple of doors knocked down. Yeah. Okay. Um. So somebody's going to have to go and get Cerise. That'll probably be you, Vogue. Yeah. Well, I got to oh, make sure the explorer's okay. Yeah. You know, the explorer's not. The explorer's totaled. Total. 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 Totaled. After all the damage it's taken. I know you've been repairing it. But oh yeah, I know. I was figuring, I was like, when are you going to finally say enough is enough? Because dear God, now. how much repairs I've done. Yeah, well, with all the stuff that you've been doing and plus hitting the wall and all that, yeah, no, it's gone now. Okay. Well. So in that case, in that, you don't have the vehicle anymore, do you? I'll walk. You'll walk. Well, it'll, ta it'll take two of you to carry Cerise. Babu will come with, well. Do it. I get some healing? Yeah, you're on full points, mate. 
Oh, I didn't hear that. Sorry. Actually, we can have Babu and Jazz go carry Sarik. Uh, I can carry her. Well, she's in that. Um, she's in a status state. Right? So Cat and I. Uh, so I can work on the reactor. Cat can do the uh, subspace. Well, you also. Um, bear Doc in mind can go. The workers will be. Or, coming yeah, Doc can go. So the workers well. will be coming back at some point, and they do have yeah. at least one dump truck with them. Uh, and we probably want to, so stay armed. Is basically what Chad is saying. Right. Well, they got machine hey, guns, right? Who? The workers? No. Towers here. Yeah. We'll. Oh, yeah, the yeah, vocal well, yeah, go. Well, the assumption, the vocal assumption round them up. That... Get the machine guns. Bring them back. Okay. You want to take them out of the towers? All right. All right, Find so all the weapons and secure them in the med bay. <laughs> Why are we taking okay. the heavy weapons out of the fortification spot? That's what I'm asking. But you guys wanted to do it, so... Well, well are you going to man it or not? Uh, yeah, not if we don't man, man it, it, they're just going to walk in and then they can take... Yeah, I figured we have to man it, otherwise we're going to get surrounded by like 30 workers. Uh... <laughs> I don't know what All we're right, doing then, we, uh, uh, When are we expecting them back? Then, Cause... which way do the workers come from? Do... Northeast. Northwest. Okay. Uh, Jazz, do you wanna? Yeah, sure. Jazz will man the yeah. uh, northwestern tower. You've still got the heavy. You still got the heavy laser on the on the explorer too. Don't forget. Would it take a while? That Doesn't takes take a while to, to, dis to dismount get off. No, oh, only a few minutes. Oh, it took an hour to well. put the mount on, but it just did. Click, yeah, but that was because you was that w you had to mount them in the first place. Dismounting them is a lot easier. All right. Well, I mean, if we can dismount them and get it up the tower in pretty uh, relatively short well, time. Do you want? Yeah. Okay. Well, there's enough. There's a, the, the 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 machine gun up in the northwest tower. Um, there's a number of mount points up there, so you, they can be moved around. Um, do you want to leave the machine gun up there as well? Yeah, you'll sure. need to put a I'll second. Have. You'll need to set, put a second person up there to to, to man it. Well, I Cat figured Cat will just shoot with one. Okay. Well, oh, you don't want to, you, Cat, you and I have Cat things to do in the compound. You don't want to take on the computer, Cat. That I know takes, you know it was there. That, that's going to take like twelve hours to do that kind of work. Do we really have that time? The surgeries. Oh yeah. We're not going anywhere. So, I mean, the surgery's been going on for a while too, don't forget. Yeah. yeah. And you were one of the first people up. If not the first person up, because you had the computers to work on. Yeah, so, okay, hang fine. On. I'll, so, I'll... The, but hang on, hang on, hang yeah. on. So, based on the fact that you were one of the first people up, maybe you were the one who who went up and manned the, man, the machine gun to start with. I mean, how long do you guys want to wait before you man the, you man the towers, if that's what you're doing? Or check the compound out, or whatever you're going to be doing. Well, check the we before we did the surgeries, we checked the compound and the. No chance. Sorry, no. You guys said you went and did the surgery first. Well, no, we cleared all the rooms, right? No, we you had a quick look around room. all the rooms. Yeah, you went through. You, that, that that doesn't mean you searched every room. You said you. Okay. You yeah. Then when they're doing the, they're doing the surgeries, who's ever not being performed on goes and searches the compound, and then we. Have one person man one of the guns. All right, well, cat. In that case, one, two, three, four, five, six. I need seven search rolls off your cat, please, because you were the first one done. All right, what don't the... fail any of them. No, you failed one of them. Oh, he failed one. He failed the third one. Which happens to be, for argument's sake, that room. You didn't see, you didn't find anything in that room, okay? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what you have found, um, can you give me twelve d one hundred rolls, please? Then you can add those together. Add them together. Okay. Yeah, you can add them together. You can add them make them the same roll. Add them the same roll. I'd type that out. <laughs> One, two, 
one, two, three, four, five. Not bad at all. You got a hundred in there. 10, 11, 12. Well, you got a 99 too, and a 91, and an 86, and a 94. Jesus. Um, you find 7,010 credits. Okay. In, is in somebody 12... recording this? Well, hang on. Is Cat, are you handing it over or are you keeping it? <laughs> or are you handing over some of it and keeping it? Uh, you find 7,010 credits in credits, as in credit chips, amongst uh, the 12 lockers in the uh, guard room. Which, okay? Oh. Plus a bunch of... Um, Plus a bunch of um, clothing and assorted personal effects, pictures, hollow books, things like that. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, in the workers' barracks, w w there's twenty odd bunks in the workers' barracks. Uh, there's a whole bunch of personal effects. Plus um, a uh, plus a computer, the computer or a computer, the only one you found so far. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Yep. Uh, in the in the dining hall, there's nothing but uh, the food dispense, the food machines, and the four service pots, and enough benches and chairs to feed everybody. Okay. You don't find anything anything interesting in the supervisor's room, which is that small square one. Okay. Uh, in the room where you guys are. Um, there is the subspace radio uh, and the med bay stuff. There are also uh, in the storage area, in the storage containers are in there, you find four type four power batteries, four type four power batteries. So Ten back to the question, is somebody writing this down? <laughs> yes. Yeah. 10 okay. type three power batteries, seven type two power batteries, 50 gas masks, 10 kilograms of D19, of TD19, uh, 20 weeks, oh, enough uh, food uh, food for to feed the entire staff for 20 weeks, which is enough to keep you guys going forever. Not ever, but for a while. Uh, four freeze fields, one grenade launcher, 24 frag grenades, 24 smoke grenades, and 24... It's basically 24 of each type of grenades, in incendiary grenades and the rest of them. If you're going to read a this out so quickly, can you just copy and sorry, paste it? Because I can't keep up with it. No, I can't. No, sorry, mate. Oh, sorry, mate. Sorry, mate. Sorry. What, what are you up to? What are you up to? What did you, did you get the freeze, you get the freeze fields? I, I've got them all. I've Is the all. grenade launcher a grenade launcher attachment? No, it's a grenade launcher. Oh, okay. See, both you can okay. have your own now. Thomas, well, no, I want an attachment. Take three frag grenades to fill out his barrel. He's carries. Yeah. So 24 of each type of grenade. Is that what you're up to, whoever's writing it? And you should have pulled me up a bit quicker if that was the case, Ben. That's all right. I don't mind being pulled up. Is that what you're up to? Thomas, so did you 24. get it? Yeah. 24 uh, of each grenade. Yeah, 24, 24 of each type smokes. of grenade. Yeah, 24 smoke, 24 frag, 24 incendiary, 24 whatever. Okay. 24 does. Okay, a do two dozen of each type of grenade. Okay, there's a thousand clips. There's a thousand ECU clips. A thousand SU SCU okay. clips, right? Um, each twenty, each twenty SCU, and there's a thousand clips of bullet ammo. Now, does anyone have demolition skill? Jazz. Jazz, that 10 kilograms is enough to blow the reactor. Okay. All if the I entire compound much. without the reactor. So, we could blow up the entire compound, but the reactor itself would stay, uh, <laughs> stay completely yeah. running. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> um, the reactor, uh, the, by the way, the reactor has a, has a lock on it, by the way. The reactor room has a lock on it. Well, Captain I can have get a key. that after I get alive. Yeah, well. Captain, yeah. what type of lock is it? It's a level four lock. So is it like a number pad? Is it a handprint? Is it Whatever a level four lock is, I can't remember. <laughs> so we just stick the captain's hand on it. 
to someone. No, that no, no, no. I tell you, now, even modern day bio bio uh, bioelectric locks don't work that way. A dead hand does not work. A dead finger does not work. A dead eyeball does not work. But you know, ignoring Hollywood completely. I know because that's uh, that's actually I did my I, I did one of my um, IT masters courses on biometrics back 20, almost 20 years ago now and even back then that that stuff wouldn't they wouldn't work that way. Interesting. God, it was almost 20 years ago. I can't believe that. 15 years ago. Sorry. Okay. You're well, old. Anyway. Well, you are 51 as of yesterday. Yeah, shut up. Go go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> you know my. My my parent my parents gave me a card to uh, yesterday. It was a yellow card, yellow card, and it had half a dozen rabbits on the front. Okay. Good thing you didn't get a red card. No, no, no. It was it was a yellow card with half a dozen ra half a dozen rabbits on the front. And you opened it up, and the card said, "Seen any grey hairs lately?" <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's what I said. Nice. Yeah, thanks, mate. Thanks, mum and dad. Nice one. Ta. Yeah, I'll see the grey hairs now that the white hairs come in. You know the worst part? About 15, 20 years ago, I'm very hirsute, okay? Very hairy. I looked down at my chest and I found a grey hair in my, che in my chest here about 15, 20 years ago. And ever since, I've been a silver front. Not a silver back, but a silver front gorilla. Okay. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> years uh, ago, anyway, I had a... Uh, sorry, go on. I was just going to say, years ago, I had a friend I worked with who was his hair on his head was all gray by 29 yeah uh, some people do that i had a, there's this guy i worked with he, by 30 by 32 he was completely bald no, not from shaving from hair falling out i think you get it from kids yeah yeah sounds about right <laughs> what exactly yep. is our mission here Blow up the, blow uh, up the well, we need to get to the subspace radio to get us a ride off before we blow up the compound, smart one. Okay. But yes, the idea. Dis you disable the mining operate. Disable this mining operation. Um, and the best way of doing that is to blow the reactor. Right. Well, we gotta so contact to the spaceship here, for a ride off the planet first. Yeah, one at a time, guys. What was that? What was that, Bab? Well, I was just saying, if they're supposed to be mining here, this is a mining place, and they've got another compound to use too. Yeah, but it's a matter who. That gets one's it. radioactive. Right, the old compound, the, the CDC compound's radioactive. Right, um, so if, 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 they need a new compound, you... and this one's already working. Mm. Well, minus a few yeah. doors. Minus well, few but it's their enemy's, enemy's compound, enemy. so it's like. A... No, it's our compound now. Yeah, your instructions were to, your instructions were to disable the other mining operation compound, which is where you are now. And that, so that would involve, okay. as I said, blowing either destroying the compound or destroying the reactor, um, which is ever as easy. Once you get into the, into the the reactor room, you'll be able to work out which is the best way of doing it. But that involves getting Cerise. That's Abu's job. She can heal carrier. All right. Well, you'll need two because she's in the stretcher. Yeah. She's in the, the Doctor, yeah, the if area. the if the Room, if the uh, reactor room's locked, Babu and Vocal go. All right. Because the and doc that, is that performing you... surgeries on everybody. Yeah. So, Cat, is that you up in the tower, or is that? That's yes. Jazz. That's Jazz up in the tower, with the with the heavy laser. Is anyone going to go up in the tower and man the machine gun? You know, if you're slaughtering workers, the machine gun's probably better. I'm just saying. It lays the dump truck if you need to, so they can't crash the gate. And I then mean, you can switch to a machine gun for the miners themselves. Yeah. Yeah, but I wouldn't just go off and start killing the miners. No, no, but... Yeah. But if they resist, but yeah. If so what do you do? Reason. So what are you going? What are you going to do when they uh, call them up when they get inside on the radios and see if you can get them to surrender or what? Yeah, well, get them to surrender. I let let's get Cerise first, 
and let's not interact with the miners until we're done here or they show up. All right, so you got are you two got uh, it's Bebu and Bebu and they, the two Jalasites going for Cerisa. Yes. All right. Well, you're going. It, it, you, 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 it's going to take you a full twenty-four hours or so to get back here with her, because you've got no vehicles. I thought she was at the tree mm -hmm. line. Yeah. I thought she was. Ah, oh, yeah, it was the tree line. Well, so that's okay. just the kilometer there and the kilometer. Okay. So when you get out, when you get over to her to where you left her, she's missing. She's gone. No, I'm joking. <laughs> she's not. Uh, gave you a fright for a second there, didn't I? Uh, yes. <laughs> I was just thinking, well, that kind of makes sense, leaving a body out in the forest. Um, yeah, I know. Yeah, uh, new character. Yeah. <laughs> new character. Yeah, um, right okay, so, so it, it takes you about three hours to get back, two and, two and a half hours to get to, to, to get over there, get her and get back. Um, in the meantime, the miners have not shown up. Cat, have you had a go at the computer or not? If we have that much time, yes. Okay, well, you better give me an op. Thank you. Okay, um, and a display information. Okay. So uh, the computer uh, doesn't have. It, it's got, um, a, you know, a, a personnel list, um, some information regarding um, the uh, the amount of um, uh, ore that's been mined. And a few other bits and pieces. None of it really relevant to what you what you guys need to know. Yeah, what you're doing now. Okay. Uh, it basically runs the maintenance and food preparation aspects of the of, of the um, of the the system. If you were to wreck it, you would you would not be able to get food out of the food dispensers properly. Yep. For example. Okay. But yeah, there's not much else. It does not control the com the the reactor yep. or the electric fence. Okay. I'd still take all the information. Oh, um, and this can be done later, but um, can we get a listing at some point of all the equipment from the dead bodies as well? I can do it for you now if you like. Uh, Garajet rifle, auto pistol, 40 rounds. Garajet rifle, 2 rounds. Um, Sonic Sword, half a half an ECU clip. Uh, skin suit, uh, forty points left. Inertia screen, uh, SEU backpack, uh, thirty SEU remaining. Backpacks can be recharged, is that right? Backpacks can be recharged. Sorry, that's a belt pack, not a backpack, the belts pack. But yes, belts packs and backpacks can be recharged. How much time does that take? Uh, basically an SEU an hour, depending on what you're charging it off. The react If you're charging it off the reactor, it's probably a bit quicker, like two SEU an hour. Um, you got all that? Yep. Uh, laser rifle. Backpack fully charged. Sonic sword. Uh, fully charged clip. Albedo screen. Four frag grenades, auto pistol, 30 rounds, vibro knife, full clip, albedo screen, full belt, pa full belt pack. Got all that? Electro stunner, 20 clip, full fully charged clip. T 
two tangler two tangler grenades. Stun stick, full clip. Inertia screen, full belt pack. Missed it. Needler pistol, eight shots, barbed. Sonic sword, full clip. Stun stick, full clip. Inertia screen, full belt pack. Two laser rifles. Two fully charged belt packs. Full vi uh, two vibro knives, each with a full clip, and an albedo screen. Got all that? Mm -hmm. Yep. Six laser rifles. Six belt packs, three fully charged, three empty. <laughs> three electro swords, half empty clips. Three albedo screens. Three automatic rifles. With a hundred rounds between them. Three sonic swords. Two with fully charged clips. One with an empty clip. Three gore screens. <coughs> three half empty belt packs. Twelve assorted skin suits, varying between um, five points remaining and five points taken. And that's it. <laughs> unless somebody wants to give me, unless somebody's going to search the um, the uh, commander's room. Well, would we know that oh. Kat? Or I guess if we didn't find anything there, somebody else would search it. Well, Cat didn't. Cat was the only one who searched. Cat didn't find it. Cat's th th that's right. Cat's anyone. When I get it. back from carrying Cerise, I can search. Okay, we'll wait till you get back then. So, can, come, sorry, go on. Uh, I'm just going to ask, can someone unlock the cache of big rooms and I'll just paste in all this stuff? Can you someone can't. unlock what? Only the person no, who creates it's, it can it. Unfortunately, no, you can't. You can share your note, you can share your note with everybody else, though. I, oh, I can make no. it, yeah, he, you can make your own. Oh, but you cannot unlock that. Yeah, no, only one person can edit it. Actually, two, me. Well, two if you count the GM. Yeah. Whoever made it in the GM. But the GM's not really a person. They're more of, like, this evil demon that nobody likes. Uh, I'll remind Babu and Cat of my email that I sent out. What'd I do? Anywho, um, 
so you you guys make it back with Cerise and um, place her on the operating table in the mid bay. Are you good if I do my search? Is that just a yeah, major John. surgery? Uh, no, it's a deactivate. The, it's a de deactivate um, the the, sc the screen, and you don't get the plus twenty percent. Nope, I don't find it. the yeah, that's right. You don't find anything. You don't get the plus twenty percent for being in a mid bay because you need to be in a mid bay. So I don't, don't get see a skill for that. Oh, activate, activate. Deactivate free skill. <laughs> Oh dear. How long has been in that free field, Cerise? Do you remember? I know we already 10. took two points off. Well, did we? Oh, that'll be the two points that we took off. That's okay then. All good. All good. We won't take, we won't take any more. We don't need to take any more. All right, now it's a major surgery. Again, you, st and you, you still don't get the 20 points. You still don't get the 20 points. Oh, you do get the 20 points for being in the thing. No, no, you don't. You need it to be. So it's a straight major surgery roll. And Cerise, you wake up on a on a you wake up in a strange room, Cerise, uh, on an operating table. With a doc, looking very very relieved. Like nothing ever happened. No, no, <laughs> I don't know about that. We'll talk okay, so about the side effects the when we're off this we plane. Cerise, we took all over the entire outpost, and there was absolutely no treasure to be found. So, um, yeah, there's nothing. I just want my grenades back. <laughs> Those grenades, they hurt. You talk to Kat about grenades. I'm sure she'll be very happy to talk to you about grenades. Hey, Kat. Can um, other individuals try to search the supervisor quarters? If you want. Cherise has a good You search. don't find anything either. No. Nah. Neither do you. Jesus. No. The dog, maybe? The dog, yeah. <laughs> the dog and Babu are the only two who haven't tried. I don't think Doc has a role set up, but. He does. What is it? Intuition and logic? Yeah. It's an average. Yeah. It should be 72. This is a 70. No. Nope. <laughs> all right, Babu. It's all up to you. I gotta do a search. You gotta do a search. Yes, please. Nope. Uh, nope. Oh my. Nope. All gone. All gone. Jesus right, so Christ! Probably the most important room. What do you guys want to do? Call uh, Jazz. Jazz will man the tower, just waiting for the. Mm -hmm. We want to get on the subspace radio and signals to the CDC. Okay. Well, that will be an operate. Uh, that will be operate machinery route. From somebody, or is that a tab? Uh, Babu will go up there. I think that's anyway. isn't that computer? Okay. No, is that computers or what? It's an operate machine. It's an operate machinery roll. Okay, let me pull it. Like yeah, okay, that's good. Somebody got it. Somebody I mean, got, you got it. Well. So you sent you, you get a mess. You, you send the subspace message through to the CDC that you're ready to be picked up and that everything's okay, or whatever. Yeah, that we're the we're about to blow the reactor mm -hmm. compound oh. security. Well, well, do we know how many out miners how long, there are? And well, find out how long it takes for the ship to come get us. If it's weeks, oh, it'll be, that, it'll, be a, it'll be a couple of days. It'll, it, it, well, um, no, the uh, the the apparently your pickup ship was working in the out in the outer um in the outer um. Yeah, actually, it might be a while for outer um what do you call it? The outer um solar system, and so they'll be there in about twenty hours. Is that a day? Doc saying how many miners? Tell them about the miners. Looks like about 20. According to the according to the personnel records that Cat pulled off the computer. Because I don't think we want to slaughter the miners. Uh, mm, yeah, yeah. Well, not unless they resist. Not unless they resist. Uh, is there anything else you want to guys want to do before the miners show up? Uh, if Cat could get me into the reactor room. Uh, that would be me, actually. You? You yeah, can bypass level 4 lock? I'm the only one who's going to have a chance. 
Uh, oh, yeah, that's a yeah. technician thing. Okay. Uh, there are no, there, there, there are no. Um, there's an alarm on it, but there's no other defenses on it, mate. Okay, then here's the open lock. Yep. That was Critical easy. Success. Critical success. Just the red and blue wires. You just touch them together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this large room, the large room beyond, houses the reactor that powers the compound. All right. Um, the walls, um, and this is more of an engineering thing for uh, for both of you, but the walls are steel reinforced plasticrete, unlike the rest of the compound. So any, 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 um, yeah. Uh, with the, within the room, the reactor core is surrounded by electrical generators and machinery that control the radioactive pellets and cool it and, and so on. Both of you, as technicians, though, it would take a level six technician to manipulate the machinery to fuse the reactor. Okay, so neither of us. I'm still not convinced we want to blow the reactor or blow up the plant. I mean, we've shut down the mining operation by killing everybody. Right. Well, not the miners. You have the mining operation is still going on as we speak. Right, but it's right now. It's effectively an independent mining operation because Streel has no control over it. Um. I mean, wouldn't it be beneficial to CDC to turn over an operating? No, they want it flown. That's what they, they they've told you. They want it flown. They want okay. it disabled permanently. Um, so yeah. Then we'll have um, Jazz set the explosives, but not, not turn them on. Well, you'll let, you'll need to get Jazz down from the from the tower, then, won't you? So we can just do that after we do. Well, any. Does it hey, what was that? Do it now. Nothing. Well, you can set them. You can set it. No, you don't have to set it off now. No, I was just going to say either. Do that after we deal with the miners, but it doesn't matter. We can set the charges now or later. I'm fine with doing the wall any time. So, uh, so if you, uh, so when you enter the reactor room, um, can you give me a just a, a, a set explosives roll for the knowledge, not necessarily to set the explosives? <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. You know, justice demolitions isn't that great actually. You're the only one who's got it. Yeah, we know it's not that great. <laughs> uh, you're 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 pretty sure if you use five kilos of the ten kilos you have available, uh, you're pretty sure that you could um, uh, 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 blow the reactor enough uh, to to uh, slag it. Con well, you know, actually not blow the reactor, but blow the machinery around the reactor to cause it to shut down permanently. Uh, okay. And not uh, and any any resulting radiation or anything leakage like that would would not leave the room, assuming you do it from outside the room, or do it on a timer. Okay. Um, so you can do that. And then, but it's anyway, so it's the only way. It's the only way to be sure. Pick yeah. Movie. So so Jazz goes okay. ahead, does that, then returns to his post on the Washington. All right. Well, you better you better set me. You give me a proper set a proper set demolition roll then, please, mate. Oh, so that one, okay. That was just so for the one. knowledge. That was oh, just for okay, the knowledge okay. of, of how to go about it. Because uh, it's a reactor. Um, You've never blown a so, reactor before. Well, well. so Jazz will ask guys, do you guys want me to set it now, or do you want me to set it later? Because if it's set now, you know, uh, a stray radio signal, I don't know, might blow it up. Who knows? Yeah, not yet. We can do it when we're okay. ready to leave. Uh, okay. And then Jazz goes back well, to the tower. Okay. Well, you only just make it back to the tower before, on the hor on the on the horizon, you see um, uh, some vehicles and what appears to be some heavy-duty robots uh, approaching the compound. Contact. What's everybody doing? Obviously, Jazz is manning the heavy laser, and Babu is manning the machine gun in that tower. Is that correct? So far, yes. Right, was there so a, the if someone is better with the machine gun, they're more than welcome to take it over, but until then, I will try to do my best. <laughs> Everyone except the doc, I think, has a little bit of projectile. Uh, yes, there's a ladder to the roof uh, there. Someone get the uh, south 
southwest tower. Southwest tower can also see. Yeah, I'll get the southwest yeah, tower. Yeah, no, the get... southwest tower is not as good. I mean, don't forget, you've got the you've got the um, the northeast tower is probably your best bet because the southwest tower you've got the uh, scree. Oh tower. yeah, that's right. They'll be coming to the front gate. They will be coming to the front gate most likely. So then the north east tower then as well then probably. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what are you doing? Sorry, Cat, what are you doing? Uh, I guess I'll go to a machine gun that covers the front gate, so... Which will be that one down there. Yeah. When you finish looking at all the blood and guts of the people who died in that tower. Yeah. Doc, what are you doing, Doc? Um, I think Doc's <laughs> going to stay inside downstairs. Where? Well, where he is? Yeah, I'm else? moving him into the, the, the hangar bay, whatever. Oh yeah, vote grabs the, one the, of those well, skin that's, suits. That's the guard. That's the guard room. That one. The, the machine shops next door. Oh. But that's oh, okay. She's just saying. Machine well, shops. The, the doc has historically stayed in an area where he can at least see if someone gets hit and might need help. Well, that would mean outside. You're going up on the roof, are you, Sarit? Yeah, Cerise well, is up he on the can, roof. as long as we can contact him on the radio on our phonocoms. Comms, yeah. He, he'll be uh, in. He'll you... probably be inside, but you know, close. Where yeah, are he's... you standing on the roof, Cerise? Uh, where I've, where I've. Where you are? Okay. okay. Unless there's pretty... some sort of cover. No, pretty much no. The roof's pretty flat. Um. One thing to say out loud is that I got a pretty hard stop tonight, so if this is going to take longer than 20 minutes, I'll be leaving mid-fight. That's okay. Yeah. It's all cool. And what, what do you, what's, do you can't ask what you're doing? Uh, going to my birthday dinner, so. Oh, the one that I had last night that no one, no one said happy birthday for. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all right, mate. Hey, happy birthday, Ben. Thanks. Yes, happy birthday, Ben. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy Got that right, Matt. It's Ben's, Ben's turn now. Happy birthday to you. Ah, oh dear. Um, so, uh, are you guys just going to wait for these, these, these trucks and that to approach, or what's the story? Um, Do we have a radio that we can call them on? Have you tried? Well, no. We can try. Do we have one that we had captured? Mm -hmm. So who's going to do the talking? Our main talker guy. Who is? Babu. Babu, isn't he? Babu, just tell him to surrender. Well, yeah, I think we got to do this kind of like... Uh... Oh, I got persuasion, don't I? You do. So what do you have to say to him? Look, guys, there's been a slight regime change here, and in order that nobody else gets hurt, it'd be advised to stand down and uh, cease and desist, and... Stop where you are. Not approaching the, uh, the compound. Who is this? Uh, comes, comes, comes back. We're gonna, we're, we do have to uh, provide them with some food if we're not going to kill them. You know. I'm not Who talking to them. I'm talking to the guy yeah, here. Obviously. Yeah, you can give them. You can give them. Uh, you can give them food. They don't need necessarily need blankets because they're not going to be. You can give them blankets if you like, just so they can sleep out there. But I mean, yeah. Uh, and the yeah. reactor is getting ready to blow, or is set to blow. So. Yeah. We is that what you're saying to them? No. Okay, what are you saying to them? Because the last thing that came back over the radio was, who is this? Dabs? What do we want to tell them, guys? All right, we're, we're going to have like a speaker right phone where you're phone. relaying it through the con chronicom and then we're going to well, tell you and you have it on you. We tell them they can't come home and all their stuff is ours. They're gonna be uh, right tell them... But if the reactor has gone bad with uh, this whatever happened here, and it's about to blow, it's better that they get away from here. 
Yeah, no, just tell them that we're mer- we're... We're mercenary- well, hmm. Can, uh, can, yes, can Jazz just- just jump in? You can jump in if you want, it's an open mic, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, yeah, look at what Sarese said says. in the chat, Babu. What it says to the- to the workers. Um... What was yeah, it, Streel? Like Streel is no longer in, in control of this outpost. Uh, we suggest you stop. If you do not stop, you'll be fired upon. Uh, according to this, and here's a warning shot to show that we are serious. Jazz fires a warning shot over the convoy. Wow. Okay. And so, the you know, convoy, and the convoy they stop. comes. They stop. They stop. And we will right. right. not ready you for your safe transport from the hold, planet. Hold. Hold. All right. I get to talk over everybody else because I have to because I'm the GM. Right? So, please. Keep an ear out for me when I'm speaking. Um, it takes a little while for the for the uh, how many of them are there? It takes a little while for the there it is. No, it's not. Uh, four heavy duty robots to stop, but the six ground trucks virtually stop on uh, as soon as the laser blast flies over everybody's head okay so uh, somebody was saying something and I couldn't catch it because everybody was talking over everybody else including me so I believe you were on the radio jazz uh, and Jazz say, uh, we will discuss the terms of your surrender. Uh, we will provide safe transport off planet, uh, but you no longer work for us. And, uh, uh, so why can't? We, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, there's a bit of a humming and harring, and yeah, you can hear some. You hear a quite a bit of. All of you can hear quite a bit of um, consternation in the background. Um, yeah, what do we do? Blah blah blah. Yeah. Um, so then you know, what, what, get out what, your vehicles. What, what, what happened to the captain and the, and the rest of the security crew? They're all dead. You killed them. You killed them. Yes, they're all dead. <laughs> more Jazz, this is what Jazz is going to say until someone else butts in. Rhubarb, 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 in the background. Um, and so um. Um, how do we know you're not going to kill us? Uh, so long as you're not armed, and so long as we follow our orders, um, there's no reason for us to kill you. You are valuable laborers. If we wanted to kill you, the second we saw you, we would have opened fire. Who are you? When the guy I'm his friend. <laughs> Um, okay, so look, um, unbeknownst to you, your corporation raided this planet, killed another mining crew that was here. We have returned to exert control for the CDC. We've killed the Streel security forces that murdered the CDC miners. We have a ship coming. We will allow you to come in in small groups. To, uh, to grab your belongings before we our ship returns and t carries you off planet. This facility will be destroyed. Do you wish to comply? Again, in the background, rhubarb, 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 rhubarb. Um, yeah, okay, so, so, so what do you want us to do now? So not over the open radio, but just to our team. Let's let them come in and in groups of five, get their belongings, and then we'll collect out in the field, um, and they can get food and belongings while they're here, and then we'll wait for our ship, and it'll come pick us up and. Okay. 
Okay, so uh, do, you t do you tell them, so what do you say to them? And what he said to them? Uh, I would to like to suggest that these are miners. CDC comes here, they're going to need miners too. Yeah, but you don't know how long it's going to be before CDC... No, but know. they might actually still have a job here if that's what they're looking for. Possibly. Yeah, so what I'd say is tell, tell them they can come in in groups of five, they can get their personal belongings, they can get food supplies for a day, whatever they're going to need for the next 20 hours, and then we're going to congregate out. They're going to congregate and wait in the field for our ship to return. Okay. Uh, but they have to get out of the vehicles and approach on foot. Yeah. Okay. Good. I was waiting for that. Um, so yeah, look, uh, there's a bit of again, there's a bit of more talk, and then and then come back back over the radio comes. Yeah, okay, uh, the first five of us are coming in. Um, so five burly miners, uh, looking worried, civilians, but you know, I, mean, I wouldn't. I mean, I wouldn't trust them with a pickaxe. Put it that way. Um, I wouldn't let them get too close to any any one of you either. Um, uh, they uh, they approach, uh, move or move around to the gate, and stand there outside the gate. So then why don't, uh, I'll, I'll climb down, the two of you in the north tower, or well, maybe, maybe... Probably the Babu should be there, he's, he's the more burly and... Uh, and a yeah, so Babu person. and Jazz yeah. should come down, keep the two west towers manned, because they're west of the compound, I'm sorry, east. They're, two, they're east of the compound, right, Matt? Which, the five at the gate, or the rest of the miners? No, they're to the, the north, the Dad. The rest of the miners are the, to the northwest. Okay, so then keep the two north towers manned, and then Babu, have Babu and, come down. And, right, so Babu's and coming down to the gate. Up. Babu's coming down, and I'm assuming you guys are armed, obviously. Yeah, and I'll I'll come down as well. Okay. So, what are you doing about the gate? We gotta unelectrify it and open it. So that's cat or Cerise. You guys got to figure that well, one out. Well, ask one of the miners if they know how to deactivate the gate. Nope. Or just it's tell them. To it's always no. It's deact always being deactivated from inside. Okay, so I will investigate then. Okay, not a worry. Uh, where are we? Um, that's the gate. 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 Yep. Um. Sure. Just touch it. No. 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 <laughs> I'm looking for the... Oh, there it is. Yeah, okay. Um, it's a level... Th it's a level four... G a level four lock on the gate, mate. Would you want to give me a... Relevant roll? That would be fine. Thank you. I I failed it. Oh, you did, didn't you? To detect Oops. the alarm and defense. Oops. Oh, it's to detect alarm defense. Yeah, you, you don't know... You don't know if it's, if it's alarmed or, defend, or defended in any way, but you do know it's a level four lock. I'll just tell them to come through the uh, cr open fence to the south. No, the open fence isn't an open fence. The open fence is a damaged fence that's still sparking. Um, you would not like to go through that gap in the fence because it's not really a gap. It's more like over the wire. Okay. Um, all right. Well, I no, will sorry, try... It's, it's, sorry, it's a level three lock, not a level four lock. So I will try and open the lock. Uh-huh. Yes, you get the lock open and the door and the gate opens up. And then we'll, and the we'll stay back, and but we'll escort them and stay a couple meters from them, guns sure. leveled. Um, look, look they're, they're, some of them look some of them look resentful. Some of them look a um, uh, little bit worried and scared. Some of them look, yeah. I mean, these, these are tough men, but they are civilians, and the fact that you've got guns at them, and all the rest of it, and the fact that you managed to wipe out a a guard force of twenty odd, I think it was. Um. Yeah. Uh, twenty, twenty, more than twenty, close to thirty. There were actually, yeah. Um, so uh, there are thirty. In effect, there are six lots of six lots of five gu uh, five miners come in, grab gear, grab blankets. A couple of them grab grab some of the mattresses off the. Pardon me, off the bunks. They all grab um uh rats, uh, mill rats and and water canisters. Um, and they all go. They all start. They all. Well, the first group starts to head back towards the vehicles, but you guys don't want them back there, do you? Nope. We want them so in the open field, away from the vehicles. 
Yeah, all right. So you all drag them to a certain area away from the you know, open field, away from that. Um, it takes quite a while to cycle all the miners through, um, but still, it's, you've still got plenty of hours left before the ships are supposed to arrive. Anything you guys want to do in particular? Uh, is the cache a big boom? Yeah, the cache a big booms too. Just gather up our gear. I don't think we have time to make it back to the locals, right? No, not on foot. Oh, which reminds us, um, we asked the workers, like, where are you guys keeping those local, that local species prisoner? So you enslaved them. Oh, they're all dead, says one of them. Looks like the foreman. Ah. So you guys slaughtered them? No. No, 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 they just died. Okay. And a few of the other miners look a little bit uncomfortable at that. I'm guessing they worked them to death. Are you saying that out loud? Sure, why not? Yeah, uh, some of them look very uncomfortable. Well, you guys... Uh Jazz will see to it, minus. Well, you're lucky we're taking you off planet. Otherwise, we'd have a whole lot of angry natives uh, hunting you down, and we're not leaving any weapons with you. You can't leave. You can't murder us like that. It's against the. It's a, against the, uh, the the frontier. Um, against the Geneva Conventions. Yeah, the equivalent thereof. And who's going to protect you all the way out here on Al on Alcatraz? Alcazar. We're, we're not going to... Alcatraz get is close enough. <laughs> oh dear. All right. Um, look, um, the rest of the... Tw the, rest of the, uh, the rest of the time travels pretty well without incident. Um, you get some... A few insults and uh, some dirty looks from the miners and things like that. Eventually, um, a shuttle lands not too far away. Um, uh, everyone will fit on the shuttle. Um, what about what are you doing about the reactor or the compound for that matter uh, well before that we take uh, all of the can we load all the like goss and albedo screens on to the shuttle oh, of course yeah uh, yeah so or can for the sake of it we just take everything that we can generally carry in the cache of big booms too I mean, we're not going to mm -hmm. take all 50 gas masks, but you know, okay. just for the just for the it's sake only, of keeping only, it simple right now. That's only that, that's only a single crate. We might need it uh, with all those miners. Oh, so then, take <laughs> everything in the cache of big booms too. Put it on the shuttle. Is that okay? Yeah. Happy with, okay. Happy with that. And yep. the cache of big booms as well. We'll put all the big booms go in the shop. Yeah, all right. Okay, so... Um, um, also, yep. um, before we actually depart the planet, can, can the shuttle take us somewhere closer to the... I forget the name of the, no. the locals. No chance. Race. No chance. There's nowhere to land. Because hmm. it would be nice just to let them know that uh, the outpost is no longer, no longer a threat. We're blowing it up. Oh, they'll figure it out soon enough. I guess. Yeah, they'll get the idea. <laughs> yeah, I would lock the reactor door and set set the timer for twenty minutes. Lock the reactor door, and then go jump on the shuttle. Mhm. Mm okay. Um, you still got to set the charges though. Yeah. Yep. Right, I think. All right. We are. How much are you going to use, and what are you going to do with any left over? So, we'll use what what we're thinking. Half a kilo. Uh, uh, sorry, full kilo. Uh, I'll get it right in a minute. Five kilos. Half the amount that's there. Yeah, uh, we destroy the... Well, we destroy the machinery around the reactor, and it's no longer able... Well, it'll be slagged because it'll, like, overheat and whatnot, right? Yeah, that's right. That's exactly right. So then it'll leak okay, radiation, yeah. and that radiation will stay within that mm -hmm. wall, but it won't provide. Yeah, provided you provided you close lock the door. 
Yeah, we locked the door. Leave the door open, the radiation will leak out. Yeah, that's what I said. We set the lock. Yeah, okay. What are you going to do with the other five kilos? Keep it. Yeah. We don't need to blow the you compound don't and the... Well, you, don't, you, don't, you don't want to use it on the equipment? On the, tr the trucks and the heavy duty robots? We should. Is there a reason to? Oh, can we take the robots? The heavy duty robots, oh god, geez, with the miners as well, you know, it's, it's going to be a very, very tight fit. I mean, heavy duty robots are the size of cars, you know. Can they do two trips on the shuttle? No, they will not do two trips on the shuttle. <laughs> no, I mean, th think of like a big caterpillar that's automated, right? I mean, yeah, that's, that's basically what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You're not talking something we're going to adventure with. Yeah, we're not going to use them. The CDC will be like, uh, why you guys bring those? Uh, uh, you guys going to sell them to somebody? Uh, we don't know who to sell it to. Again, CDC is going to be mining here, so. Well, I'm just asking you. you gonna, I'm just asking what you're going to do with the other. Yeah, you know, is he going to do anything with the equity? We should equity probably stuff? blow it. Just leave it. Okay, just leave it. That's what you're doing. All right, can you give me a, can you give me that that roll, please, mate, for the setting of the charges? All right. Well, with the uh, CDC, based on our brief contact with them, would they want us to blow up the machinery? Probably. It's yeah. Certainly, want you want you to disable things with, beyond repair. Considering they lost twelve of their own people, I think we should blow it. Okay. Yep. So, what, the heavy vehicles and the heavy-duty robots, you just put them together, set a charge there, and try to blow that up? No, I'm going to need a charge for each. A charge on each or each supply, each engine or whatever powers it. Okay. Yeah, but it, only, uh, it, only, needs to be, it only needs to be 500 grams each. So then how many, so how many, okay, how many rolls? For those well one one for the, the for, just roll for the reactor and then there are there are what do i say four trucks and five i think you said six uh, trucks or six trucks six, six trucks, trucks and four and bots and four robots yeah that's right yeah six trucks and four robots yeah okay so 10 rolls um i'm going to do 11 the bots. actually 11 well i'm going to do the bots and the robots first just to make sure that they the bots and trucks first okay yeah uh okay There's one critical fail, unfortunately. Uh, what does 500 grams do to you if you blow it up? Hurts. Yes, I know that, but how how hurty? Wait, I'm sorry, I'm counting how many rolls I've done so far. One, two, three, four, five, nine. six, seven, eight, nine. Well, I think each charge is 50 grams, and each charge 500 is... grams. No, no, each... Oh, know. each charge is 50 grams. Combat yeah. charge. Yeah, each combat charge is 50 grams, that's right. So there's several critical successes there. Yeah, two. Yeah, two critical successes and a critical fail. Uh, let's see, each 50 gram charge, I'm looking it up now. How much mm -hmm. damage? Yeah, it's like a small grenade. Uh, each 50 gram charge is 5d10. Right. And so that's 50d10? Uh, no, and every and every extra 50 grams is an extra d10, I believe. Is that right? No, it doesn't every multiply. 50 grams. Every 50 grams is an additional 25 points. 25 points. Okay. So, okay. Um, yeah. And we were using timers and all these. Uh, yeah, I'm assuming you're using, using timers and all these. Yeah. All right. Um, you misplay. You misset the timer on um, on that second one, and it goes off uh, close enough, uh, soon enough after you move away from it that um, it ends up causing you um, uh, 52 points of damage. Okay. Jazz. Uh, jazz is. Oh, let me see. Uh, fifty-two points. Uh, six of which gets 
sorry, how many points? Yeah. 52? 52. So, 5 2. So Jazz needs major surgery. And this okay. gets shredded. Yeah, okay. So quick major surgery roll, please, for Jazz. First aid, then major surgery. Other than that, all the charges are set and go off as, as, per, as planned. First aid, 110 points. Uh, and yes, that's fine. You're fully healed as per. Okay. A okay. You want to set the charge on the reactor? And before okay. you do that, where's everybody else standing? <laughs> back outside, back at the, well... I think Cerise has to lock the door, so I'm standing outside the room. Everybody uh, else should be back with the mining. I'm by the shuttle. Okay. Fair enough. All right. Give me, give me the, give me the set charge roll, please. So Jazz sets it and exits. And does Jazz have a um, inertia screen on? Uh, no, but we would have put on a new skin suit. All right, can you give me a, can you give me that lock roll, please, mate? Which one, the lock? Mm, yes, please. So it's successfully locked. Um, you guys sprint for the the shuttle. The shuttle takes off. Um, twenty minutes after the charge was set. Um, you detect a slight explosion from the area around the um, where the the compound was or is, and um, look, it's a it's a pretty rough it's a pretty rough voyage home. They they really didn't have enough room for all these miners because the ship wasn't designed to take that many people. Um, you do tend to press um, the uh, life support. Um, not to its limit, but it's pretty pretty close. I mean, you all come off the ship. You know, you, you have to ration water. You have to ration food. You have to ration showers, things like this. So when you make it back to civilization, you're all pretty pretty smelly and stinky and, you know, um, and the rest of it. Um, are, you let, are you just going to let the miners go? Uh, we'll have the CTC deal with them. Yeah. All right, well, the CDC lets the miners go. Um, um, and uh, and you guys get paid out. Uh, I'll work that out over the break. You guys get paid out what you should get paid out. Um, you, uh, you, 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 everybody gets three experience points. Just three? Just three. It wasn't a particularly clean operation. You got there in the end, but it wasn't a very clean operation. And um, because Kat's got to go, um, we're going to wrap that up there, unless anyone's got any major objections. No. Nope, all good. Nope. All right. Um, so, yeah, uh, if you want to play those ending credits, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you all in two weeks' time. Yep. Um, probably for a new adventure. <laughs> So um, we'll see you all soon. Well, that's it for this session. We hope you've enjoyed the game as much as we did. We'd like to thank Smiteworks, Sirenscape and Twitch. And of course, all the fantastic people involved with the Star Frontiers RPG over the years. I'm Dulux Oz. And on behalf of the entire gaming group, we'd like to say thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time. Until then, may your God go with you.